old. Someone just call me old? <laughs> what the fuck? Come back over just to hear old. <laughs> what the heck? Who did that? Why you do that? How dare you? Well, thank you for the resub. Um, welcome everybody. I hate. Oh. That's it. I'm I'm banning I'm banning Robbie from picking gods. I am I'm I'm going to find a way. I don't know if that's a way. There's a thing to do that. But I'm going to do that. I swear to god. <laughs> I'm going to be like all gods except set. So let's start doing random gods. How about that? How about them apples? Welcome everybody. We are back from the smite game. Um we played for a little bit there. And now we're gonna be playing over here. And we just hanging out. We having a good old time. I'm eating a banana. Hope everyone's having a marvelous Monday. I have banana. Mad everybody in here. So if you guys are new to the channel and don't know, you can do X Wish Mark join to join the queue. Uh, if your name is different than your uh, Twitch name, then put that on the same line. X Wish Mark join space and then whatever your in game name is that helps me find you easier and quicker are you guys like super duper heckin excited for a uh, new god revealed tomorrow or not tomorrow wednesday i don't know what day it is uh time is a construct i'm gonna keep eating my banana you'd still probably end up with set you're probably right because rng jesus hates me if i have no jam what do i put on biscuits gravy Hey, Snow. Can't ban me. Oh. Oh, yes, we can. <laughs> so how is, uh, how is Pupper? Do we have update? Do we know anything? Get them in. Boy, can't I. Easy Nama game? It might be easy Nama game. If I can uh, manage to get a carry roll here for once. <laughs> Start with five. Cast you on, do a trilogy. It does worry me a little bit. Like, I don't know. Marvel sometimes does, like, dated things, right? Like, they kind of do, like, you know, Captain America, like, obviously was back in the day or whatever they kind of do that kind of thing but then then they bring them to like current day and i'm kind of wondering what they're gonna want to do with x-men like are they gonna want to start in the 60s or are they gonna just like kind of retcon it a little bit and just like start now with like a bunch of teens or something i don't know or maybe like start i don't know like even late like maybe like like 80s or something like so, something so that the current day x-men are not like fucking 70 years old you know what i mean because i mean we're talking the 60s and they were like teenagers it's been it's a long time <laughs> 60 years later you know like they're gonna be old as fuck they're not gonna be like x-men anymore you know but we're the marvel universe is set in like nearly our time i think maybe a little bit past our time so, I don't know. Ooh, I love Gambit. I have a, a Funko Pop Gambit. Alright, I'm almost done with my banana. Aww. Hello, bro. I heard your diamonding set tonight. Oh, who spread that rumor? Hmm. I never changed my picture, so it's just Resident an Evil now. Forever. Resident Evil forever. Together. Why right, hold on, I gotta change it. Mm -hmm. Each star mommy. Arms? Alright. Banan has been vanquished. 
So yeah. Um. Marvel saw that funny character made people like that character and put the same personality to every hero since then. <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. Am I upset though? Nah. <laughs> I kind of, I kind of like them having a sense of humor. I mean, I don't know. Captain America probably shouldn't have the same sense of humor as like Deadpool. That just feels weird, but I don't know. I, I do think that they had to do that to Thor a little bit because Thor, I, I think Thor was struggling. I'll be honest. I think Thor, like no one, no one liked those movies. No one liked the character. No one was like already a fan of that character. Like people were just kind of like, meh, you know? So they had to do something to make him a little more like enjoyable, entertaining, which sucks, but that's, you know, it's Hollywood for you. Greaser Jean Grey. <laughs> They'll show an alternate reality to merge them, but are they going to be like coming from the 60s alternate reality? Like, is that alternate reality also back in time too? Because that just it seems so... It just seems so, like, messy. I, I don't know. We'll see. I just have a feeling that they're going to make X-Men current current day dudes they can still be in another reality but like i don't think going back into the 60s is gonna be a good move unless they just don't really plan on making them oh my god we got rat who was asking for rat earlier <laughs> look at that look what we did uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, it, unless they don't plan on merging them to like have the the X Men and the Avengers and everybody else like intermingling, then I guess I could see it. Like just have them in their own little blurb. I'm sure, the X Gene never got developed. Some mutants never happened in the Sacred Timeline because in the comics there are a few mutants that are powerful enough to know what he was doing. Yeah, that make a lot of sense. Plus, I mean, X, you know, people with mutations are just strong as fuck. You know? I mean, look at freaking, like, Magneto and stuff. Um, acting seems like the hardest profession ever. <laughs> I couldn't do it. I know that much. It's just, yeah, I think, like, it's also Disney. I think Disney, Disney just Disney-fies everything, you know? It's like, Disney with, like, cartoons and everything they do now kind of has that like sort of like humor but then you mix in a little drama and you, you know it's like it's a delicate balance but i'm not a fan I, I i'm i'm not not a fan of it you know i watch them all i enjoy them they turn thor from a dude to a bro <laughs> yeah oh big time but like I said, like I think they kind of had to. Kind of like how they made Iron Man into like a narcissistic douchebag, you know? It's like we still love him. But I think they had to take a little liberties with personality to make them more entertaining cuz otherwise it's like no one was looking forward to a Iron Man movie, you know? No one was looking forward to that movie. Everyone was like, "Wait, this is actually a good movie?" And it's just because Robert Downey Jr. got to like play that character with that personality and it, it just like totally meshed it totally just jived and everyone was like yeah yeah but like actual iron man don't give a shit don't give a shit put mommy back on screen <laughs> we'll go back to mommy okay we'll go back to mommy later this mommy's busy busy doing smart things yeah it's like, and you know, you see the same thing with Star Wars and stuff too. I, I think the criticism is like completely accurate, but I'm just one of those folks that's just going to keep watching them because I don't really care. I would love to see them go more extreme, like, you know, Deadpool realm rated R type shit, or I want to see them go into horror. I would love to see them do something spookier, scarier. They kind of did that with them. Um, uh, Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness. A little tiny bit. That get, that, that, that movie was kind of... It was kind of fucky, you know? Like, it was kind of effed up in some some cases, so... 
You know, like I, I want them to push the envelope a little bit. But I'm okay with like the mainline Marvel stuff just being like a happy, goofy time. <laughs> I'm not playing an assassin, I'm not good with them in assault. No, most people I are not. Most gods, most assassins, no. But someone asked for a rat game, and by golly, I'll give them a rat game. Even though I'm pretty trash. Why do they have two guardians? Because they hate fun. One of them's probably building damage. Maybe. <laughs> if I were them, I'd, I'd do Ku's damage. Surprised Kenobi wasn't darker. It did get kind of bleak, though. I mean, they. they I don't know. Is it, is it okay to do spoilers for Kenobi? It's been like a month. Um. I mean, they, they literally were dragging Obi Wan through, like, fucking fire and shit. I mean, it got kind of, it got kind of bleak. I thought. <laughs> they got kind of dork. They had, like, Anakin peeking through that mess, like, crack, you know? And, like, oh, man. They, they had him literally, like, entombing him. I mean, I thought, like, no, like, no one was dying or bleeding out or anything, but... It was actually scarier than I thought. Like, I was like, oh, they actually made... They actually made uh, Darth Vader, like, pretty spooky in this. For the first time, I was actually like, okay, Vader's scary. <laughs> so I liked it. I liked what they did. How much did everyone raise for Snooty? Um, I don't know full totals, but for our community, we raised a little over 1,200. Man, get off of me! Get off me! I'm just a little rat! <laughs> There's hints from MVM not emerge, but they exist and because the Starks moved to announce himself, make him a center of attention. Xavier likely saw no point in establishing a team that would work in daylight or public eye. Yeah, potentially. I think, I, I think at, like at this point, there's been so many heroes and like they're all kind of like know all the other heroes, and I think it'd be kind of weird to pretend like they didn't know about the X Men at all at that point. Like, I, like, at some point you have to believe that, like, Stark or somebody would have found them out, but I think, I think with the, all the multiverse stuff that's happening now, that's what's, that's what they're gonna do. They're just gonna call it a multiverse. I kind of personally hate multiverse stuff, but at this point it's like the only way to explain a whole bunch of stuff, like Deadpool, like pretty much all of the Fox properties, the Sony properties. They are in a corner because of all of the companies that own their shit. So, it sucks. Wish they would do Marvel Zombies. They're doing Marvel Zombies as a show, not a movie. And it's supposed to be um, like actually legit, like like adult, like not for children. Which, so I'm, I'm really excited about it actually. I think they're just now kind of getting into that like darker realm, so we'll see. We'll see what happens. I won't hold my breath. It's still Disney, but they're saying it's supposed to be a lot darker, to the point where they're even gonna have like, you know, kid mode on Disney Plus, so kids don't get that content. of Dukes of the Galaxy moved to San Francisco started mar dating Mary Jane read a phone app well okay but I guess that's my question is did they do that in older comics or is it just new comics because are they just working with the the Tony Stark that we have now and like you know writing stories based off of the way that he is currently or was that always him because I didn't think he was always an asshole like how they showed him in the movies. I mean, okay, assholes kind of strong, but you get what I'm trying to say. Pretty narcissistic, at least. Because I feel like a lot of current comics have, like, changed. Like, they made Thor, like, funnier in a lot of, like, recent Thor comics and stuff. 
So I can't help but think that that's just because they they almost like wrote their own canon <laughs> at this point. Because I'm literally playing Rat. What do you mean? What do you mean you want a Rat game? I'm playing Rat. What do you mean? Oh, thank you for the hydrate. I gotta grab my bottle. Uh, baby needs bottle. Um, Avengers can get away with a comedy. Next one can get away with the darker things. I hope so. When they originally talked about that new mutants movie, I thought that was gonna be a lot scarier, spookier. Ended up being not at all. <laughs> Ended up being kind of a joke. So I don't know. I hope so. Some really scary freaking mutants, man. Like. You gotta get luck and get X balls. 87% chance I'll do decent. Dang, man, you were in the numbers on that. 87%? It's kind of what I love about Assault, though, is like. Sometimes I get the weird, wacky gods that normally I wouldn't want, but it kind of like reminds me how they play, and I'm like, oh yeah, they're kind of fun actually. Kind of like right right now, like I haven't played him in a while, and I'm like, okay, you know what? Like, it's pretty fun. Tank, are you trying to get someone into your van, or like, what? what? Are you trying to share? <laughs> I want candy. I ate the banana, nature's candy. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like Daredevil. <laughs> Stop it, I'll beat the shit out of you. <laughs> Xavier uses the ability for decades to hide all the mutants in plain sight. I mean, maybe he's just that strong, you know? Like, it probably took a toll, but, like, Xavier's a pretty strong dude. Especially if we're talking, like, older Xavier and not, like, newer Xavier. But, yeah, no, I, I think they're just gonna go multiverse. It's, like, the only thing that- it'd just be easy. It'd just be real easy to be, like, yeah, they were in a different universe. Bing, bam, boom, boom. Different timeline, whatever. Die, please. Enemy is being I believe Rebel said Kenobi's a dark series. It was, though! Dude, you never got Obi-Wan, like, getting dragged across coals and shit in the other shows or movies. That's pretty bleak, man. They got Darth Vader jump-scaring everybody. I mean, it was dark. They were, they were gonna kill a child? I mean, come on, man. It's pretty dark. It's pretty spooky. Black Adam movie looking sick. I'm a little worried about it. Oh, I forgot my nut. I forgot all about my nut. This is how you can tell I really don't play rat. <laughs> I forgot I even had a, a nut. Alright, nut. Which nut do I want? Um. Health is nice. This is the crit one. Oh, that's kind of nice too, though. Let's see, just more damage in general. Um, so, protection, speed, and, eh, I don't really feel the need to go tanky, so we'll yeah, just do that. We'll just do that right there. An enemy has been slain. Hey, yo, Nitro! It sure looks fucking incredible. Ugh. She looks hot. No, I'm, I'm a little worried about Black Adam just because it sounded like the people who, like, you know, got to see it early were not, not having it. <laughs> so I don't know. We'll see. I hope not, though. I, I really, for DC's case, I, I hope that it's good. I really do. Experience a whole lot of Susano, so it's a weird experience to go against him and be utterly confused. <laughs> play set? No, I didn't play set. Man, it's always the teammates, right? Didn't play set, but I'll play set in a second. Hate him. 
hate it. <laughs> get it? Get it, chat? He said you're nuts. Get it? You're nuts? <laughs> okay. Night night, Penguin. Oh, Penguin, did you did you watch when I played Nox? I played Nox earlier. I don't know if you saw. I was waiting for you to say something. Oh, I'm dying. Yeah, I died. Greed. The greed took me. Okay, yeah, that should be good. Um, three scenes make the series. Right, what? Not, what? What? Man, man. The whole time, Darth Vader was scary. Man, dude was like ripping, ripping up doors and jump scaring the shit out of people and murdering people and it was scary. They were torturing a child? I mean, come on, man. Every single episode had something bleak, dude. Bleak as hell. I mean, sure. Not like super dark. Not like crazy, like poking out eyeballs dark or something. But like, for for Disney, I thought it was pretty dark. I think Deadpool will be uh, the universe. They have Colossus ready. I think they'll add the recast of X-Men there and just merge that reality. It's just have like an entire multiverse of like... Wow, that's like one more than one. I mean, I guess you couldn't do the Deadpool one, because then they have, like, different actors for Colossus and whatnot. Yeah, I don't know. We're all just gonna be one big, fat, stupid multiverse. Ready, pen. Pen. Oh, uh, no! I did! Oh my gosh, oh, uh, does anyone remember? I think it was 8 and 1. I went 8 and 1 and it was a Guardian Knox. Penguin, I did so good! You'll have to look at the, um, the Smite game VOD, maybe. The very, very last game, if you want to check it. I actually did pretty good with Nox, and I was like, rat, or, uh, Penguin would be so proud of me if Penguin was here. <laughs> I don't like that he makes Rebel upset. Yes, yes he does. Yes he does, Deco. I hate Set. Oh no, my wrath, he's broken. I had one good moment with my random triples and now I'm falling off. It's okay. They're just getting extremely thick. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, we'll just keep focusing on some pen and keep pushing as much as we can. Yeah, I was playing, I was playing. Oh, oh, wait, Nox is playing with me? Oh. Oh, oh. I wish. No, it was kind of gross. It was kind of gross when I was playing Nox. Because we went up against a Kabracken, so anytime he did uh, his little ground pounds, I was just like, okay, take take a circle. Take my circle, bitch. <laughs> it was great. Damn, we don't have any health pots anywhere. I guess I'll pop my I don't like it. Ow, fuck! Is that- Oh, never mind. No, 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 that's ours, that's ours. I, I thought the- <laughs> I thought the Huyi ult was killing me. I was like, fuck! <laughs> Just dying, burning. Thank you, Penguin. I can mention that Spike game. Yeah! Yeah, because I was like, you, we were literally just talking about it. I was like, oh my god, where's Penguin? They needed me to play a Guardian. I was like, fuck that, I'm not playing the Guardian again, so... We're knocking it out. But anyways, just wanted to let you know. Have a good one. Get some sleepies, boo-boo. GG's, guys. Thank you. Thank me! Someone say... 
I don't get the Ishtar like she's 710 at best. Cheek, how do you continue to have these horrible takes, man? <laughs> what do you mean? Unfortunate cheekbone. Man, you've got unfortunate cheekbones. Don't unfortunate cheekbones me. You kidding me, dog? Look at her. She got booba for days. She got cheekies for days. She got chin for days. She got horns for days. She making me horny. Bruh. Come on. Come on. Now we gotta do 1v1? Shit, I was supposed to play in set. Ah, so much to do. All right, ninja. Listen up, cause this is this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. Okay, you hear me? I will one v one against you, but I have to play as Set, and you have to play a random god chosen by the randomizer in my chat. I was winning wholesale, and we actually did really, really well. Rat feels nice. It sure is fantastic. And you are insane, sir. Uh, they cast some dude as young Uncle Ben and a young Emma Roberts as Mary Parker. Emma Roberts? Emma Roberts? Is that the person I'm thinking of? A lot of actresses, various spider women and spider girls. What? Wait, why do they have so many? I'm so confused. Yeah? Alright. Cool. 1v1! Alright, so we're blind picking, but obviously it's not blind. <laughs> Two birds, one stone, baby. All right, you ready for the random? Charybdis. Set versus Charybdis. Wait, what? Oh, I I was I was going to I was going to pick the I was going to pick the god. <laughs> um well don't know what you would prefer. <laughs> I mean, you can take Dead Man's Yaga, or you can take my Charybdis, I guess. I was gonna, I was gonna roll the god. That's up to you, I guess. I won't force you either way. I gotta play set, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Look at the prediction. <laughs> it's because you guys know you've seen my set. <laughs> Uh, Terminator story? Someone goes kill Mary for Peter's born? Oh. What the fuck? Oh, it's so wacky. That's fun. Oh, Mac, you shouldn't have. You shouldn't have. I am, I am so bad with set. Why would you pick me? <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that. That's <laughs> okay. I like I said I was I was going to pick but I mean it's up to you. I've seen a lot of yaga and a lot of char so I mean uh, it's up to you man. It's a little confusing but whatever. I mean honestly if I were to pick I <laughs> I'd pick Charybdis, no doubt, dude. Although Yaga's not terrible either. But Charybdis is pretty good. She's gonna be... She's gonna be hella annoying. Alright. <sighs> Time to die! Hmm... <laughs> 
Kyle. How you doing? Ugh, this is horrible. <laughs> this is so bad. Berserk, what are you doing? You voted for me. No. <laughs> Thank Gussie, please. Oh, what have you guys done? What have you guys done? Wow. <sighs> I mean, I kind of... <sighs> Someone did say attack speed was supposed to be fun. I don't know. I mean... I don't know. We'll try, I guess. With this passive and everything, I guess it's supposed to be fun. We'll try. Um... <clears throat> Just... It's all we can do. <laughs> might as well try something different. If I have to play him, I might as well do something different, right? Okay. Christ. Time to die! Hi, Stone Cold. ADC said, I don't know, not so much ADC, just more like attack speed um, assassin instead of ability assassin. So I was talking about it, I think it was Smite game folks, and they were like, yeah, no, attack speed's actually pretty poggin'. I was like, well. So we'll see. I never would have guessed, but then again, I don't know squat diddly about this man, so. Haha, <laughs> G. G. Silver Bridge, pretty funny. I don't think I'm gonna get to that point. I don't think this is gonna last that long. To be honest. Put ADC set work. I don't know. I don't know about that. Just for the mere fact that, like, him being, like, you know, ranged really only comes from the abilities, you'd still have to build a decent bit of, like, cooldown, I would think, to make it really worthwhile. Because his autos are just, you know, they're melee. Now they kind of suck in carry lane. What he said is ew. See, I never know. Like, I, I just assumed, based off his kit, that that was going to be the play. But honestly... I have no flippin' idea, obviously. I fucking didn't get my ult, that's cool. <laughs> that's, that's cool. I know. A tool to focus my rage. Your middle tower is under attack. Picky person, the Kang Dynasty Secret Wars fights. That's if uh, Tom Holland doesn't retire first. My tower's gonna go down so fast, dude. I mean, let's be let's be real. All sets are ew. I don't discriminate. All of them are gross. Build them similar to pun bats? I don't play hun bats. I don't know how to play hun bats. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, all right. We stayed alive, baby. That. Oh, dude. Dude, that fucking ult came such a long way there. I mean, to be fair, I don't think uh, I don't think Ninja really plays curved this, so it wouldn't surprise me. It's probably trying to figure shit out just like I am. My brand. <laughs> I 
mean, that's kind of the other reason why I was thinking, like, ability-based set was going to be better, because, like, cooldowns, you know? Like, more built-in cooldowns? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe it's working. Love and Thunder goes on Disney Plus. How many times have Reg <laughs> Rev we watched the flick? I like how I keep calling it the flick. It's like the blip. <laughs> Ayo. Um... See building. Mm, interesting. Okay. Yeah, that's why I was thinking, like, you know, you get something like Soul Eater, you know, like. It's kind of got all of that built in, you know? Powers, lifesteal, cooldown. Ah, uh, you know what? I should have gone Keens, maybe? Still can. <laughs> and he got the ADC if you're brave enough. Yeah, that's true. I don't think ADC necessarily requires anything, but I do think it's easier if you're playing ranged. But, I mean, you know. I think it's necessary. The fuck? So much. No, oh, but really, why can't I pause the game? <laughs> that is awesome, dude. That is oh my god, that is so crazy. Wowie. Um Final Time Reese graduation? Oh, you got this, dude. You got this. You're so close. That's awesome, man. Home stretch, dog. Oh man. Alright. Sansa 3 does damage and stacks your passive ult healing proc. Stacks your passive ult healing proc. Oh god, I don't know what that means. <laughs> I don't know what my ult thing is. I don't really understand the ult that much, to be honest. Um, okay, okay. I think it- doesn't it also, like, give me protections? Just... Yeah, physical damage, which is kind of nice in this case. Kind of works out. Um, if you like pop, if you old pop three. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Ah, all right. That makes sense. <laughs> I think. I don't know. Still haven't watched it, Tom. Still haven't found a moment. I know too well that kings must watch like that. I tried my damnedest over the weekend to just like not be online like at all and just because I I have so much streaming to do this week like so much streaming so I tried really hard to just like stay off of everything for a bit I could get berserk shield surprised He's not building anything else. Hey, Didi. Well, you are welcome to join us if you like. I'm doing a 1v1 at the moment, but uh, you can join for some viewer games after if you'd want. Exclamation mark join with your in-game name. Okay. 
kill was set? A kill was set, Admiral. I know. I'm just as surprised as you are. Honestly, Kryptus might beat me here just simply because of the objectives. I don't know. A little terrified. I'm not taking down objectives very quickly. The Kryptus can just like maul them, so I don't know. I don't need beats for that. <laughs> Five layer burrito or cheesy bean rice burrito? Five layer. 100%. 100%. Oh, I die here. Maybe not. It's always rough doing duels with hunters. <laughs> It's so nervous. We we can potentially win on kills, but I am extremely worried about our objectives right now. I mean, Cryptus could literally just tank the entire Demon King. Like, come on, man. I don't even think I can do that. It's one of the reasons why I kind of enjoy doing 1v1s in like arena or something, because at least then it's just minions and not like towers. Cause man, hunters get extreme advantages in any game modes with towers. Oh. That does not work on the clone. Yeah, no, that's that's fair. I would not assume so, but that's you know that makes sense. Oh my god! All right, we just need one more. We just need one more. I don't even think my actual ult proc there. Look at my ultos, they are so spicy. Oh my god. Did it? I, I thought it like, I thought it had to go away to actually proc, but nah, maybe not, maybe not. Maybe not. I crazy. I don't know what I'm doing. That wasn't obvious. Me. Oh my god, if I win, whoever voted against me, or actually, whoever voted for me, you guys are gonna have a big ol' payout, dude. I guess I was thinking of the damage, the damage uh, explosion. Yuck, crit. Gross. Damn, got red too, huh? Four ticks on the enemy. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. It's right. It's not the. It's not the full thing. It has to just hit four times. Forgot. God, set's confusing. <laughs> I hate set. <laughs> All my homies hate set. If I can just keep playing defense, we might be able to do this. Mac, you were you were the chosen one. You were supposed to be with me all the way. What happened? What happened? Oh. <laughs> I 
No, he's not. No, he's not. <laughs> I keep forgetting the max resolution on Steam Deck is only 720. Which seems kind of tiny. Is it really only 720? I thought it at least got to 1080. Maybe not. I thought the Switch was the only one that had like crazy small display. So it's got a learning curve. You're damn right he does. Jesus Christ. Ain't just whistling Dixie, man. 1280 by 800? Oh, okay. Yeah, much smaller than I thought it was. Surprising. Surprisingly small. Yeah, not by much, though. I mean, shit. It really is. It's like either Charybdis is going to get the objective or I kill I kill Charybdis. It's pretty much it. It's pretty much it right here. No! Oh! Uh, ah, that's it. That's it. That's it. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> oh man. Or unless uh, uh, nah, 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 it's not happening. It's not happening. Oh my god, GG's. GG's. That sucks. That sucks so bad. It was a good game. I went in, man. I felt like I had to. Damn. Uh, so close. Well, true believers, we almost got him. You guys almost had a huge payout there. Everyone else just gets like, I don't know, 200 points or something. <laughs> Since there was like barely any votes for me. Let's see, how many? 18, 18k divided by how many people? <laughs> oh my gosh. That was so close. I'm telling you, man. I feel like I honestly have to start doing 1v1s in, in Arena. Because I feel like, I mean, even though Hunters are still going to have really good clear, but... Things like towers and stuff, I just- I'm not gonna be able to get them if I'm, like, an assassin. You know? I don't have the range or the DPS for that kind of stuff. Hmm. I don't know. It's like those- those nights where we, we do, like, the 1v1 nights, you know, where we only do 1v1s. I always do arena because I feel like they go quicker, but it's also a lot less stress, I feel like. Because you don't have to worry about any of the objectives. You just kind of like, like, yeah, you could like shoot the minions if you want to. You could level up with them or whatever, but you don't have to really worry about getting like out objective. Did, did, did. <laughs> you know? Even guardians, I feel like, have that benefit because they don't have to worry about like dying in tower either. It's like, I don't know. It's just, it's kind of rough. Anytime I play like an assassin or a warrior, it's like you kind of feel like you're you're not tanky enough and you don't ha do enough like like auto damage to a tower or titan or whatever, you know. Oh wait, ninja's restarting their router. Oh well, ninja, when you get back, we'll I'll throw you in the match. Thank you again, Berserk, for the hundo. By the way, I'm sorry I didn't win for you. It was so close. If only I'd gotten that kill. That one last kill. I probably should have kept playing defensively and not pushed up too much. Hello, Lazaro. 1v1 arena is faster too. Yeah. Yeah, because I think on the joust 1v1s, 
We run into the risk of getting to like half an hour on some of those fights. It's rough. I got better though. If anything else, I feel like I got a little bit better at set. <laughs> it's like the smallest, tiniest little like silver lining. But I mean, I feel okay about it. <laughs> feel better. At least. I didn't feel like I was like a total waste of space for once. <laughs> Wanna see a Sobek take a tower though? I don't remember if we have ever done a 1v1 with a Sobek. I know I've done a lot of 1v1s with other guardians and as long as you build damage, you can just sit in that tower and like tank it up and smack it. I mean really, you could just let the minions smack it and just hang out, <laughs> you know? It's surprisingly easy, um, which is why I always tell people like when you're going guardian, don't just like, don't don't build uh, defense or at least the, the littlest bit of defense because we're gonna be here all day. It's gonna be impossible to kill you. I'm sorry, Deco. I'm sorry. I tried so hard. It was two one, Deco. I lost on objectives, Deco. I'm sad, Pav. I'm so sad. How much did you guys even end up winning? Like, per person? Was it even worth anything? Also, what's Berserk's end game name? Did I miss it? So freaking close, man. Oh, DD, uh, join the queue real quick. X wish mark join and then put your username. Uh, I can play any game mode. We'll probably do a conquest unless someone wants to play something different. Oh, okay. I'll skip you, ninja. I need berserk. Get a bracken here. Real zerk. Okay. I should look. I should have looked up zerk. There we go. Oh yeah. I cannot believe- I cannot believe on, like, a guaranteed loss, I was 2-0 and o at one point. You know? On set! Guaranteed loss! I got 2-1 and one on set! Mm. 4k? Okay, that's not bad. Well, the only thing is, like, you, you get back- you only get back what the other people voted. So, like, there was, you know, I don't know, let's say 10% of people voted me and they lost. Well, they lose all their points. But, like, there wasn't that many people and there wasn't that many points. So dispersing it amongst everyone who voted against me, you're going to get a lot less than if it were the opposite. It depends on how much the losers bet, technically. The only time it depends on when you bet, what you bet is like when you're losing it. Unfortunately. <laughs> but hopefully you guys didn't lose too much. Wasn't a lot of you. <laughs> um, 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 uh. Hmm. Do I try rat? I feel like maybe I'll just go Sue. So I feel like Sue's a good one to keep getting up. He's he's already like halfway to get diamond. Why am I on this skin? Hot zombie. My name is you oh, that's pretty cool. My what up, Winters? <laughs> doing pretty good. How are you doing? Exclamation mark. Uh, join DD. Thank you. Rainbow, thank you for the follow. I'm doing great. A little sad now. <laughs> I barely, barely lost a duel. Feels bad, man. Y'all can make me play Kabrak and Mitt. Do it. Do it. Or we get kicked out of lobby. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Poggers. Let's try that again. Score to drop, now I can get that Erling skin. Yes, get the best Erling skin! Best Erling skin. Best Erling skin. It is Corgo. Corgo is best. 
Get it. Get it now while you still can. Ooh, I'm not gonna lie. I am not a fan of that soul. I am not a fan of that soul. Nope. Not even a little bit. <laughs> Kinda glad I don't have the points for this. Cause that's um she looks like an alien. Why is her why are eyes so big? I had to quit building a PC to move to do homework. I realized I flushed some things and now I have an absolute Franken machine next to me. <laughs> nice. Uh, you getting like new PC parts? What kind of fancy schmancy stuff you putting in there? Old pee me to dust. Nah, nah. You've seen my 1v1s, Mac. I wouldn't worry too much, especially because my RNG is trash, so I'm guaranteed to get a terrible, terrible god. If I, even if I had rolled random, I probably still would have ended up with set. Like, that's why I just, I took the L and I just got, I just, I just went for it. Because I was like, you know what? It's going to be horrible. We know it's going to be horrible. So, might as well do the absolute worst outcome possible and get it out of the way. 110 viewer points, 110 K viewer points in all the skins. Uh, you got a week, you got a week. Somebody wants to come back. Spin Corgi Erlang moment. Always a Corgi Erlang moment. I got the on her skin like first time. I already had the Erlang one, so on her was a go for sure. I don't have like any skins for that god. One of his taunts sounds like don't fuck with the face god. <laughs> it does. It does. I agree. Actually, you can't convince me that it isn't. <laughs> Red play poppy playtime? Ugh. You know, I I would, but I've seen like five other content creators play through the whole like both of the chapters already. And I feel like I, it wouldn't even be a surprise, you know? I'd just be like, yep, and here he comes down the vent. <laughs> I only really like playing horror games if they're not super jump scary, but if they're gonna be jump scary, at least at least you know, get me with the jump scare. I, I want I don't want to I, I want to be surprised. I don't want to like know what's happening, what's about to come. I, Poppy playtime's already been ruined for me too many times. I don't think it'd be that fun. I'm gonna hopefully get some more done of uh, Resident Evil this weekend. This guy really likes pens. This kid's the reason I play set. It's a nice skin. I like zombies. He is a zombie. Night night Tom. Thanks for hanging out with us, boo. Get some CPs. I like the soul skin, it's just a little much. It's 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 a practically neon. It's burning my eyes. Um mum. Um, um. I don't know if Boombas was the way to go last time, but I don't know. I liked it, so I'm just gonna do it again. Not really sure what to build with Susano, honestly. I keep trying different things, and I can never find the thing that I really like. Fatal Frame? Uh, I've not played it. I think I've seen it before. Like, I think, like, PewDiePie or someone played it a long time ago, but no, I've never played it myself. Let fate decide. Can't play too scary games with the baby. It's it's very particular ones that I can play. I, I, I don't mind older ones, because older ones aren't nearly as scary. But that's kind of why I was getting into Resident Evil, because I was like, it's more than just like, boo. <laughs> like, you can actually run around and like solve puzzles and like get around and explore and stuff like that, and I like that. This is Zombie Susano. Zombie, specifically. 
I used to play a lot of Dead by Daylight. I don't play it too much anymore, but I wouldn't mind. Oh. <laughs> Wait, who the fuck? Is <laughs> Scary. <laughs> I'm so confused. Why is no one in carry lane? Nani? Are we confusion? What happened? What was I saying? Oh, Ross, up. What? Alright, I should have paid more attention to this comp. What happened? What happened? I like how Berserk is playing set to spite me now. Um... Okay, I definitely thought... I definitely thought Zonkui was? Okay. Okay. Alright, well, I'm... I'm understanding now. A little bit. <laughs> Not really. Oh well. Yeah, I used to play Dead by Daylight like a crap ton. But then I got kind of frustrated at being killer and I got really bored of playing Survivor. But I would play it again. I just haven't really found a good time. I thought about buying the goddamn Attack on Titan skins, but they like want you to do it in game instead of like through Steam. And I was like, man, I got I got like Steam wallet funds, man. Why do I gotta buy this in game? This is silly. So I was kind of mad about that. I don't understand why they are just making it in game. It's like forcing you. You can't use any of your gift cards or anything. Weird. Who snows my man, but I guess I can share. I mean, you can have him when he looks like this. I'll I'll take the I'll take the Zuko. The Zuko version. Yeah, I'm I'm a little befuddled, but I mean, hey man, I don't play raw. This could be something I don't know about. <laughs> I don't know, dude. Yeah, this is um Hey man, you know, whatever. Why does it keep saying my one is unusable? You know, I've seen that. AOT skin on who? Uh, the Dead by Daylight characters. I think there's two. There's two of the killers that have the Titan skins, and then there's like three survivors, I think, that have the. Um. I don't know, what, what would you call them? Main character skins, like, like you know, the soldier skins, or whatever. I have a DVD friend who got montaged by the US government. What? <laughs> they, they got, they got what now? Don't regain health, I'm right here! Fool! Oh Christ. Why is Robbie the only one that gets to use these? Man, I, I swear to God, there's gotta be a way. There's gotta be a way to ban Robbie from this. <laughs> I swear to God, I'm gonna find it. Hold on. Where is it? There it is. I got your number, Robbie. Your reign of terror has ended. They really rage quit? So soon? Not penis? <laughs> rage quit? Was he solo? Are you guys like both assassin solo right now? Cause that's kind of adorable. Wait, um... They're not recast or W trying to save the flash? Wait! Ezra Miller sent out an apology to anyone he hurt? Dude. No. He should be arrested. What What do you mean he got... He apologized. Dude's been like on the run from the law. Like what the... What the fuck? Ah, bullshit, man. Bullshit. He's like commit law... Like... He commit crime! 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 I know it wasn't set, but I don't care! I want to make it fair. I don't want it to just be one person suggesting gods. 
Don't worry. You, yeah, you get at least one guaranteed one per stream, so don't worry. You still, you can still request your stupid set, okay? I just want to make sure it's not just one person requesting the same thing. Over and over. All the time. Are we really gonna win this even with our goofy comp? <laughs> Use the camera to take pictures of spirits. Yeah, I think I think some pe people have uh, told me about it. Yep. Yep, we really did win be because they uh, they DC'd. Well. Well, all right then. <gasps> Throw, no, you're awesome. How you doing? No, you. Oh. Treatment for complex mental issues? Bro, what? <laughs> Bro. I hate how... In this country... You can just, like, say... Yeah, I was totally bonkers off my rocker. And then you just, like, get away with, like... Practically next to murder? I mean, come on, man. Bullshit. That's such... That's so stupid. That's so stupid, man. He's wanted for crimes. You don't... You can't just say, I'm crazy. Here's an apology. By the way, I'm gonna keep working on my movie. Uh... <laughs> no, you're not. Go away. Are you joking? My friend's DVD clip was used in a montage of violent video game clips to show that video games cause violence in children. He's playing Huntress using a Mori. But is your friend violent? Like, how is that even proved? That's bullshit. Five minute conquest game. Easy breezy peasy. Easy breezy. Yeah, that was funny. Well, let's see if we can get another, uh, let's see if we can get a win in Slash. I have not yet tonight, so. Wow, no one could have picked this. <laughs> hello, hello, Rex. I don't think stream is crashing. It's okay. We'll, 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 we're playing another game. We'll play another game. That was too short. <laughs> Ezra to Arkham. God, if if anyone's like a real life Joker, I swear to God, it's Ezra Miller. <laughs> I, you know what? I take back everything. Have him play the Joker now. Um, he does. He can't be Flash anymore. But he he'd make a mean Joker. My God, that's incredible. I mean, that's true. It's probably not just this country, but it seems to happen a lot here, and I it's, I just think it's bullshit. Considering all the people out there who have, like, serious, serious mental issues and are a menace to society and not just, like, a bunch of uh, self-important narcissistic assholes who think they can just do whatever they want. I mean, come on, man. He just does whatever he wants because he's like, oh, I'm famous. It's not mental illness, my ass. Even if it is mental illness, it's like, again, you still did bad things. You should not get rewards, aka getting to stay in your movie and make a bajillion dollars off of it. And, you know, it was funny because we talked about this, I think, last week where everyone was like, so WB is like three options. Either they can have him make a formal apology, put out the movie like as is basically with no reshoots or reshoot with a completely different person like basically re completely remake the movie and at first i was thinking there's no way there's no way they would just get an apology out of him and that would be it easy breezy but that's exactly what happened that blows my mind i thought for sure if anything they would either just put out the movie as it was or get somebody else. I mean, I know it's 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 a lot. It's a lot of money down the drain, but I guess it's a corporation. I shouldn't we have should expected them to spend more money. <laughs> I should have just expected them are. to, you know, mm -hmm. give him a little Why? slap on the wrist and Greetings. be like, "Now what do you say?" And he's like, "Sowie." I'm on it. Attack right lane. Good luck. Not an issue. On my way. Did he crash? Well, hey. It's like not 
Okay. Uh, okay. Well, I'll try. I don't know if the I don't think the pause is gonna go through if he's not actually like broken on our end. I have no idea how to play not or a neath, so I'm just gonna go wee. What the fuck does she do again? Uh, la la la. La 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 la. I hate knees. La 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 la. Uh, okay, root. Um. Uh, heal? I forgot Neath had a heal. Okay. Oh, I know the backflip. Alright, I knew the other two. I'm a little iffy on the others. Um. back okay cool yay smite yay you think Ezra is bad such of the truth about Steven Seagal the guy's a fucking piece of shit oh no I I've heard he's a piece of shit too it's it's a problem with all of Hollywood honestly I wish I had my ult right now that'd be sick um th this is how they are they literally think they can get away with fucking murder oh I didn't know that was a placeable thing oh that's my bad dude <laughs> That's my bad. <laughs> I thought it was around me for some reason. <laughs> That's silly. I'm silly. Tranquilize, go eat, silly. Don't, don't stay hungry. Eat the foods. Uh. Cool. No, I think I think there's a lot of fucking horrible people in Hollywood that get away with so much worse but it's just it's like what the fuck man the ex military itself or a batshit crazy person but i don't do shit like that yeah it's it's kind of doing a disservice to people who have mental health issues like you don't see a lot of people with mental health issues doing this crazy shit he's not mentally ill i and i don't like to say that because i don't like to assume about people but the fact that he was cognizant of everything he was doing, still doing it anyway, and was running from the law to avoid dealing with any of the consequences? I mean, come on, man. I think the conscious decisions here need to be taken into account. I don't know how this is gonna work legally, I just really hope he gets more than a slap on the wrist and a little bit of time in like a rehab facility or something. Not rehab, but y you know. Not like not necessarily an asylum, but one of those like halfway house kind of things where they just kind of like tell you, oh no, you you got issues. This is how you deal with them, whatever. For like I don't know, six weeks or something. <laughs> Sorry, I did a fucky wucky. <laughs> but like, basically, exactly what happened. <laughs> I hate it so much. I hate it so much. Welcome back, Ninja. We're talking about Ezra Miller and his fucky wonkies. <sighs> How would you want to die in a horror movie? It could be any way you want it to be. Well, I definitely don't want to be eaten alive. Honestly, just like, just, just like, stab me right in the heart, you know, st or shoot me in the head or something quick. Stab me in the brain. Just something that's instant die. I'd be good with that. I don't want anything to be like taking a long time, you know? I don't want to be like drowning in acid or burning alive. Just make it quick. Make it spiffy. I got I got shit to do in hell, alright? Can I pick a character and items with points? No, it's just one or the other. Either character, or if I'm playing a character, you can pick my loadout. Loadout is mostly um, for like shooter games and stuff, but you could you could pick my build too. It's all kind of the same, but it's either or. Um, even Caesar had a guy follow him around and whisper in his ear, "You're only human." Hollywood's out of whack. <laughs> Bro, can I have that job? Can I like? tell actors that they're only human specifically Tom Cruise I think Tom Cruise needs that guy Be right back. I think Tom Cruise desperately needs a guy that tells him he is only human because I think he forgets <laughs> I honestly think he forgets and then does crazy shit 
thinking he's not gonna die. <laughs> he's gonna die. I predict within the next like 10 years or something, Tom Cruise is gonna do something so wacky that he's gonna die. <laughs> he just pushes too far, man. Found my blue eyes white dragon. Nice, dude. Dark magician girl and red eyes, dude. You got you got the like freaking holy trifecta. It's amazing. GGs. I'm 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 extremely um I'm extremely uh jealous of the blue eyes. I used to have one. One of the few decks I ever had was a Kaiba deck. Like, you know, the starter one or whatever that you, comes in like a big Kaiba box. Man. I would love to have another one of those. I don't even play actual Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, IRL. But just for nostalgia's sake. That'd be amazing. I hit the pillar. <laughs> Now I remember why I need this gross. What? Huh? I won Athena with Rangdas Mirden? I mean, don't let your dreams be memes, Tranquilize. Do it. Believe it. Achieve it. It needs to kill them silently. Tom Cruise does need that guy. Tom Cruise is a Scientologist, so he definitely isn't human. <laughs> is that how that works? Scientologists are just become like lizard people? Wow. The truth finally comes out, chat. Damn. Get him, Tear, get him. Yeah! Fuck him up. Fuck him. Fuck him. I used to have so many cards. I used to have like Pokemon cards, Yu Gi Oh cards. Some of mine got like wrecked because I left them outside in the rain I'm like an idiot. So I don't really deserve nice things. Is it bad that I saw the Kabrakan ult and immediately thought that that was theirs? <laughs> Start shooting at it. Ah, I hit the wrong person. All right, not as not as easy as I thought it would be. <laughs> I made a fucky wucky. I thought the backflip went further, but maybe I just got extremely lucky last time. Doing some master duel right now. Nice, Draco. If I had more time or money or patience, I'd probably play the shit out of master duel. Where am I going? I can't afford shit. I'm broke as fuck. <laughs> Much like real life. Does Tom Cruise is Lizard? <laughs> Sold a lot of my cards for 10 bucks because I'm an idiot, but also 9. Man, when you're 9, 10 bucks feels like a million bucks, so that's fair. At least you got to sell yours. At least you got something out of them. Winters, why is you confused? <laughs> tricked like UG got tricked by Weevil. Bro, did someone throw your shit into the ocean? Because that's offensive. Steven Seagal did something to a girl. She's a virgin for the incident. Oh my. Oh no. Yeah. Which like, I mean, come on. If I had to count how many times that's fucking happened in Hollywood. I mean, it's like, how did- How is it so like unregulated, you know? How are they just doing this shit? 
How are they above the law? I mean, I understand that certain things, like, you can maybe pay your way out of. You get a little slappy slappy on the wrist or whatever. But, man, some things I'm just like, it's fucked. Unless they're just, like, extremely good at covering up the evidence. I guess then that you don't really, you don't really have a choice, you know? It's like, what, do you, what are they supposed, what's the law supposed to do when you literally don't have any evidence? But... That's pretty gross. Although, at, at least Steven Seagal, I mean, I'm sure he's still out there just, you know, living his little life or whatever, but at least I don't see him as much as Ezra Miller. He's not currently in a bunch of shit. All up in our faces. We believed in Ezra Miller, you know. Master Duel is free. No, I know. But you gotta pay for the packs. I've got some cards, but, you know, you want, you want more cards, you either gotta, like... Pay enough to get the currency yourself, or you gotta pay for the packs, and... I don't got the shmoola for packs. I don't know why I just, like, totally didn't even use my ability there. Um... I did buy some packs from the, like, in-game currency that I got from just playing, but it, it wasn't a lot. And I also... I don't know a lot about the newer, um, Yu-Gi-Oh! mechanics. So I need to do a lot of research. I'm an OG player. Your juggernaut has arrived. Your juggernaut has been destroyed. Fish sticks. Nah, I'm good. I'm good on the fish sticks. I'll pass. You bet. How are you doing, good sir? Gems are easy to get to grind. Yeah, that's the thing. Is like that. That's where the that's where the time component comes in. So if I don't have the time, then it's like okay, then spend money. Well, I don't have, I don't have the money. <laughs> and on top of that, I'd have to do a shit ton of research to even know what I wanted to build and how, which is where the. Uh, Patience comes in. <laughs> I don't know. It is a really fun game, though. I like Yu-Gi-Oh! is my favorite card game. It's just... There's a lot of reasons why I can't really get into it like I want to. And then Synchros I checked out. There's just a lot, dude. It's a lot. I don't think... I think the Synchros I was okay with, because it kind of just reminds me of, like, fusions. But there's, like... I mean, so much shit. Yo! That's what's up. GG's. Two surrenders in a row. You guys are too cracked. There's, a fu there's just a fuck ton of shit. I don't understand. I don't even remember what they're all called. Doing propaganda for Russia? Fantastic. Sounds like an upstanding citizen to me. You know what we should do? We should just start, like, banishing people. Like, back in the olden days. Like, you are banished from this realm. And then just like kick them out, you know? Just be like, go somewhere else. Go 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 to Russia for all we care. <laughs> GG's. Is that the caster spooky Mars from Smite game? What? <laughs> How am I supposed to play? What? Hi Spooky. What? Um Hello. <laughs> How are you doing? If you mean the the queue, you you can join the you can join the queue if you want. Or I don't. I mean. <laughs> Still use blue eyes to find new cards for him. I do, Admiral. I have a whole dragon deck. I built a dragon deck around blue eyes. That's how much I like dragons. <laughs> but it's like trash because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Aw, ninja's in a match. Uh, da -da -da. Oh, okay. I was like, I was like, I don't know what we're talking about. I'm just over here pew pewing and talking about Yu-Gi-Oh. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Understandable. Well, spooky. 
How's your Mars Monday going? Uh, la 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 la. I need a Bubba Q. I need to add Bubba Q. Toothless Puma. It's cute. Q broke? Q did break. I see you. You're on Q. You're good. You don't you don't have to re-add yourself if that's what you're trying to do. I, I I take you guys down to the bottom. Don't drag in these nuts me. I I Damn it, chat. I, I swear to god, I can't even mention the word dragon without hearing this shit. That's it. I'm not talking about my dragon deck anymore. <laughs> Anyway, as I was saying, I, I take you guys down to the bottom every time, so don't feel like you gotta rejoin queue. You're always in the queue until you leave. You can never escape the queue. Alright. Um... Actually, wait, we'll, we'll get a... Get a conquest. Three minutes? Ah. Uh, very Monday-ish, ready for Wednesday. Oh, oh. Right? Me too! Winky, winky, wink, 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 wink. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so ready. Yes, yes, yes. Stoked, man. You like dragons? <laughs> I feel like I'm a little, um, predictable. Like... I, I like dragons in Yu-Gi-Oh. I like the jade dragons. Um, I I like the girl with the dragon tattoo. <laughs> I'm very predict. I I am also very predictable. That's fair, Ninja. That's fair. We are we are two poggers for our own good. We're too strong. We don't know our strength. I'm not, you know what, I, I unironically like Imagine Dragons, okay? And I don't even care if you deez nuts me, okay? Because that's how much of a fan I am. I get deez nutted on every single time I mention them, and you know what? I don't care. I'll take it. <laughs> oh, the misery is right. <laughs> they needed to rename themselves. Specifically for this problem. You guys ruined the awesome discussion about dragons. Yeah, they did. Assholes. <laughs> Everyone always ruins dragons, man. It's always the dragon D's. It's like... Oh, I just want to talk about dragons. This has so much to ask. <laughs> I, just, I just want to talk about dragons. <laughs> Without getting D's nuts. Uh. First you go deck I built from scratch with Cyber Dragon. It's like kind of what my current ma uh, uh, master duel ma master ma master duel deck is. It's like dragons, but also cyber dragons. Cause I got I had a whole pack. Like I opened a bunch of packs of cyber stuff, and I got a bunch of cyber dragon stuff, and I was like, okay, you're going in my dragon deck. Imagine dragons is an anagram. Your mom's an anagram. Anagram these nuts. <laughs> Imagine Ligma balls. I'm starting a band and it will be called <laughs> Imagine Ligma. <laughs> I'm not seeing a problem with their name. Mm hmm. Hi, Gibbs. Mm hmm. Oh, it's a problem. It's my problem. Every time. No one else has this problem. Just me. You know Imagine Dragons uses D's nuts jokes. Do they even know? Are they even aware of how D's nuttable they are? I don't think they are. I don't think they're aware at all. <laughs> not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. You're not. Chat, you guys have desensitized me. I know it. I know it all. I was there when the D's nuts were written. 
you deserve this after the slander? What do you mean? When did I slander Kabraken? Tell me. Give me a timestamp. Show me the receipts. When have I ever... Drink your ball tea's nuts jokes? <laughs> like, come on. Dragon Ball was like these nuts before these nuts existed. Smite Dev Hour? Sure. I mean, I don't know. Wait, do they have a they have a dev hour tomorrow? I'm like streaming tomorrow. When are they doing that? <laughs> Chat's just like I don't even know what's going on. <laughs> Seems like a personal issue. I really think she should stop attacking them. Yeah, chat. <laughs> I'm I am a victim here, just like Imagine Dragons, okay? I'm not attacking anyone. You guys are victim blaming right now. I hope you know. Cyber Dragon's okay, but if it doesn't note a color of eye. <laughs> They have like a million different versions of blue eyes now. I was building this deck out and I was like, okay, regular blue eyes, ultimate blue eyes, cyber blue eyes, blue eyes mom, blue eyes cousin. <laughs> I had like three different blue eyes in there and I was like, and then I had a card that was like, if you have a blue eyes, you could summon another blue eyes. And I was like, my brain just exploded and I was like, whoa, this is the best. <laughs> my entire th my entire deck is about summoning more blue eyes. The more blue eyes, the better. I'm not saying it, Tranquilize. I'm not doing it. You can't make me. <sighs> I'm exhausted. You guys exhaust me. <laughs> Just tired. I just, just want to talk about my dragons and bees. I don't know if those words, if those words were dragon and thunder. Damn it. It's important for you to know that you are literally a goddess of breaker of chains, mother of dragons. He's nuts. Now you're ruining. Now. Now you're ruining Game of Thrones, Gebs, Gebs. Is this is this what we're doing? Is this what we're doing? Sure, fine. Take everything I love. See if I care. On my way. Okay, sorry. <laughs> All your viewer points become to me? Yo, you're getting some viewer point conversion surgery? That's a bad joke. That's what I'm saying, Spooky. Man, th there's so much wackadoodle things in Yu Gi Oh now, and I don't even want to try. I just literally am just. I, I just see this, like, book paragraph on the card, and I'm just like. Whatever, man. I know what the attack and the defense is. That's all I need to know. I, I legitimately don't need anything else. This is all just gobbledygook to me. Well, I'm dead. That was exciting. <laughs> Fantastic. I get very salty at Ego very quickly. Yeah. It's especially easy to do when people can literally just like lock you out of playing and then just keep spawning shit and the shit keeps killing you and it just keep it's just over and over every single turn they just keep spawning shit and then you kill shit and they spawn even more shit cuz you killed the shit and you're just like what ring of hell am I in you've seen red eyes you love blue eyes now get ready for pink eyes <laughs> guaranteed 90% uh, of Yu-Gi-Oh players have pink eye I can almost confirm that. I'm calling you stinky. I'm calling you dirty, stinky, poo-poo eyes. How 
you doing? In case it wasn't clear, chat, I'm making fun of you. <laughs> I have to get my revenge. Oh yeah, there's a jet dragon. Because the dragons couldn't fly already, but they needed jets to fly. It's defective. Rem! Game of Thrones ruined Game of Thrones? Shit, man. It's so true, it hurts. I don't want to get my perp, but uh, I need to find people to play with. Casual Conquest is making me rage. No one, I mean, no one buys wards. They wonder why they get the Brazzers train, train treatment via ganks. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Hold on. Um, how do I, how do I get on the train? How do I get on the Brazzers train? Um, asking for a friend. Sorry. Yeah, I feel your pain though. The only time I ever like solo queue is on Smite game. Otherwise, you you won't catch me dead playing solo, playing with randos for fun. No. But E5, if you wanna if you wanna join us, you're welcome to join us. We play Conquest, and we play a lot of other game modes too. I don't want to bounce. I want to bounce. Hi, Fiend. Nine Nice Snow. I hope things get better, man. I really do. You've been put through the ringer today. I'm surrounded if you need me. <laughs> jump around. Jump up, jump up, and get down. Oh, don't worry, Gibbs. I know how to get your attention. Is Yu Gi Oh the origin of activated my trap card? Yes. <laughs> exactly. I have to squint to look at Yu Gi Oh cards. Like, seriously, did they decrease the font size or is it just that much text? Or is it in my eyeballs? I've always been blind though, so I don't think it's me. I think they changed some. That's the only, that's the only obvious answer here. She gonna snap you. Only 90% is very generous. <laughs> I'm the 10%. <laughs> Everyone's like, oh my god, I'm dying to ganks left and right. And it's like, have you heard of words? I am like the word queen. I'm pretty sure, like, if there was an economy of wards on Smite, I would be, like, a millionaire. You know, like, if there were- if wards were stocks, I would be like, bye bye bye. Never sell sell sell. Thank you for the hydrate. Let me hydrate once I get back. Unless you're gonna go for my purple, maybe? No, you're good, you're good. I'm a drinky drinky drink. Look at that. Look at that. Two wards. Only time I don't get wards is when I'm broke. Your left tower <laughs> it's like the opposite of build it and they will come. Don't build it and they will come. I like Conquest with anyone, but I'm still really new to the game. That's fine, man. I mean, it's really up to you, and if you don't feel comfortable playing Conquest, you can always let me know. We can play something else. I am up for literally anything. I like all the game modes. Now that they got rid of Stinky Siege, I'm like good with anything. Anything and everything, baby. I know why we won twice. It's because we I had mannequins on Raw. <laughs> yeah! That's... Why? <laughs> uh huh. You just, you know, it was all like mental crits. Like, you just, you gotta put the fear of God in them. You're like, oh my God, like, why are they building mannequins on Raw? And it's like, could it be a secret strat even I don't know of? And then they're like avoiding you like the plague because they're like, I don't know what's up this man's sleeve. I don't know what they're, I don't know what they're thinking. They're crazy. 
They're crazy. I kinda like that in Smite too. If I if I have to read a lot in Smite, I'm just not gonna. I'm just gonna like look at the stats at the bottom and be like, oh okay, it heals me. Fantastic. <laughs> I will use it then. Have I mentioned that I hate Neath? Like a, like even one time this stream? Because if not, I'm missing my quota. They have, seriously, they, like, they're running out of ideas, so instead of actually, like, like, they'll make new cards, but then they're like, oh, but the cards must have five times the text. Like, otherwise, it's just pointless. <laughs> like, instead of coming up with new ideas, they're just like, we're gonna expand on the old ideas, but then make the description long as heck to describe said effect. the fuck are you even saying? What? What? What the fuck? What? What? I feel like I'm being bullied. I feel like I'm being- I'm being heckin' bullied. I'm gonna- I'm gonna go- I'm gonna go to HR. AK Raish. <laughs> Bro, what- what are we even doing? Like, in life, you know what I mean? Like, what are we even here for, dude? Why are we doing things just to, like, suffer, bro? Rebel needs better eye genes. Truth. Bip, do you even play Yu Gi Oh? <laughs> Mifflin probably is his favorite season's probably the one where they're like riding around on motorcycles. But <laughs> Oh my god, now Mif's in my game. Hacks. I can't get rid of him. It's truly everywhere. Hi Lena, how are you? She got my purple? I'm being bullied. Being bullied by a neath. I am ready. I mean, I, I guess you could say I'm ready. I mean, I've been, I've been playing it. I've been preparing my body. I'm probably doing everything wrong, so when I play it tomorrow, you guys can tell me. I'll be like, rebel, you big dummy dum dum. You would truly play Yu-Gi-Oh! If you're playing Yu-Gi-Oh, you're doing it wrong. The only thing you're supposed to do in Yu-Gi-Oh! is feel the heart of the cards, and then you just put down whatever your heart tells you. You, you, you automatically pick up good cards, and then you just put them down, and that's literally all Yu-Gi-Oh! is. There's no strategy. That is the strategy. Friendship. It's a race. <laughs> Who can fuck over the other person faster? <laughs> Chia. Chia. Uh, alright, well. What the heck? What the hecky heck do I want to do right now? I hate Neath. I hate Neath! <laughs> uh oh. I think I hit a nerve. <laughs> wow. I, you know? <laughs> I got played there. <laughs> I played myself. <laughs> Honestly, I, 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 I don't even know what it's called. That's how much of like an actual Yu-Gi-Oh fan I am. The fact that you knew what season I was even talking about says a lot, man. Like, you knew the name and everything. I mean, kind of sus, bro. Kind of sus. I'm going, I'm going. Uh, I'm seeing what's happening, and I'm going. Uh, actually, I think we got this. I'm just gonna farm. <laughs> oh, you're on easy street. 
Self-deprecating humor. I suck at that. <laughs> Die. I'm gonna die. I'm in danger. <laughs> no. They don't like me very much. What server? Uh, new era on NA. Play show accurate you go only cheat like hell. <laughs> hold on, hold on. It's not cheating if you're using friendship and heart of cards. Okay. How dare you? <laughs> Only people who cheated were the bad guys, because they're bad guys. <laughs> Make an Exodia deck equals win. Yeah. Magically gather all of the pieces that you need and win. Like, I don't know. It's make Exodia. Like, easy. I don't. You guys think Yu-Gi-Oh is hard? Yeah. I tried to tell folks where to go, but then Vitaku peeps, like, made all their characters on a different server, and I was like, rip. So then I had to start over. But I'm sticking with New Era and I'm not moving. Unfortunately, I don't know if there's any kind of transfer. Or wait, like, in the future to transfer, hopefully. Or to play with other people, like, cross uh, server would be nice. I don't know, though. I hope so. At least you can save all of your, um, like, your customization. Like, you can make a character and then just apply them to all of your characters. You don't have to, like, keep doing that, so that's nice. Words are not a deciding factor. No. No. I, um, I'm just, I'm fully embracing the Brazzers train now. I have accepted this. I've accepted my fate. Um, show me what you got. Bub. Oh my god. Absolutely terrifying. Just a crazy mofo, this Neath. You don't win, you just get very lucky. Pretty much. That's the beauty of card games, you know? Can you ever actually really do anything? No. And you know what that means is basically winning is out of your hands. You can't be blamed for not winning. You can't blame yourself for not winning. Oh my. We are getting penetrated from two sides. That's Dude ridiculous. penetrated too hard. Okay. Maybe if y'all had Jesus, you'd be winning more Yu-Gi-Oh games. You could just pray. Are the cards is literally cheap? No. No. Man, no. Oh dying. my god. I'm literally just here to get like one kill on it. <laughs> if I just if I even just get that one kill and only that one kill, I will be happy. I'm just gonna keep throwing my one on people. <laughs> one and pray. One and pray. The hell is that? Oh no, come on! Come on, guys! Come on, don't be like this. Ah! Man, why can't- why can't I have, like, cool boyfriends like Mercury in here, huh? Who wants to be my smite boyfriend? Come on. Just be my bodyguard. Follow me around. Keep me from dying. Come on, guys. <laughs> Taking applications for Smite Boyfriend. <laughs> I'm on it. <laughs> Why 
Whoa, okay. <laughs> Alright, we escalated quickly over here. Alright. Talking about Jesus is a lie? Like, wow. Wow, alright, okay. <laughs> we are we are going down a very scary path. I'm just gonna just gonna reel that back. But it's always jungle's fault. Well, sorry, Grace. I accept that. Yeah. Rules of carry. Um, don't buy wards, blame it on the jungler. Or, alternatively, the support. Whatever works. Whatever really, you know, fits the moment. Whatever makes the most sense. Or the least sense. Oh, kind of ran into his- <laughs> Kind of ran into him. Uh... I have ult! Wait, why did my ult go down? Why did my ult go down? No! Come on! I thought I put it! Ah! Damn it! That would look so cool! There's a Yu-Gi-Oh card called Card of Fate. Well then, easy breezy! Put like 50 cards of fate in there, and then you're always gonna win because it's fate. Or maybe, well, maybe it's not. Maybe your fate is to lose. What you need is a pocket, you mirror? I'd like to put your mirror in my pocket. Yes. Why not both? <laughs> True. <laughs> Guys, I need to I need to lean into this. You know, it's not every day I get to play a carry. I need to lean into my special privileges. Okay, I really want to help you guys, but I also really want to go down lane and like take the tower. So Farm up, dude. He's a demigod, Jesus is just a demigod. Alright. I mean, that sounds better than like Jesus is a lie. <laughs> that sounds a lot nicer. Yeah. Um I'm cool with it. Oops. <laughs> that wall was looking at me funny. Jesus was a lie to kid. No, no, stop. Stop saying that. <laughs> Please, I beg you. Listen, okay, I... I am... Uh... What do you call it? Not atheist, the other one. <laughs> I can't think of words. It's ah, Vyatha, thank you for the raid. Ah, oh, stream so much today. Uh, uh, agnostic. I am agnostic, but I I don't I don't want to talk about religion in a negative light. Um, I just want to keep things neutral. You know, I just want to keep things chill. And and you know, for people to not run around being saying Jesus is a lie. That's that's. Fighting words for some folks, you know? I, I, we just wanna keep it like easy breezy, people, you know? We wanna be like chillin'. Just chillin'. We chillin'. We, we be chillin' in here. Your team welcome, has welcome. Only the oh, <laughs> And that's coming from an agnostic who also grew up Christian. So it's like, you know, like I've been there. And I know I know what it's like to believe in a god and I just I just don't want anyone to feel put down, you know, for their beliefs. That's all. A raid. <laughs> Good job, good job, Gibbs, good job. High five. <laughs> we did it, we did it. <laughs> Crisis averted. <laughs> um. <laughs> Just 
Just saying. It's like, I, I, I'm I, totally like, everyone can just believe what they want to. That's fine. I just, you know, I don't want to have any cause for a bunch of hullabaloo. You know, I'm, I'm very anti-hullabaloo. What about d and I saw someone mention d and but I have no idea what you guys were talking about. We're doing- we're doing D&D? Cleric? You know I have to be an assassin. I'm playing a, a paladin in my current D&D... Uh... Campaign, and it's fun, but I feel like I'm just like like I'm always having to like save people's butts and be a little goody two shoes. I, I liked I liked my little assassin girl, who just like f shit up and didn't give two shits. I was just like skulking around, no one knew what she was doing, being all skulky and stuff. I'm the DM. Ah oh, shit. Oh, that's not that's not gonna end well. <laughs> I've always wanted to be a DM, but I feel like I would be a really bad one. Because I don't know, like, hardly anything about Dungeons & Dragons. I've only been in two campaigns. You can have smite boyfriends if you say something nice about Cabracken. Um, Cabracken has really strong forearms. Yeah. Well, I'm not run. No, I'm not run. No, no, I'm not running. What? <laughs> no, I'm. I play in one. I don't, I don't know. I wouldn't mind doing a one shot at some point. Just like that way, I could like I could dip my toes in without fully jumping off the deep end. You know what I'm saying? I mean, but let's be honest. I'm already off the deep end. Oh my. Oh, but they're so low, chat. <laughs> I wish I wouldn't have missed like one. Uh, fuck. That sucks. Demon sounds like a lot of fun. I can always come up with ideas. I feel like an actual practice would be dog water. You just have you have to like m like manage so many people all at once. And if like they do something crazy, you have to have like an answer to that. You can't just like let them run around and be absolutely insane. Like there's got to be like consequences for everything. You have to think of everything, you know. And I just, I just don't know. I just don't know if I could do that. I'd somehow like come up with a rule, but then someone would like do the same thing, and then I'd be like, "Don't do that." And they're like, "But, but, but, but," you said we could, and I'd be like, "Damn it." You grab him? Oh, I was really hoping you grabbed him. Oh, never mind. He did die. He did die. Oh my god, we have so many minions right here. <laughs> Why do we have so many minions? This is great. Ow. Like, the DM that I play with is so, like, patient, and he just comes up with all this shit, and I'm just like, how do you do this? Okay. But I guess if, if there was, like, a story that was already kind of, like, laid out with, like, pre-made characters and stuff, and it was just, like, a little one-shot, or maybe, like, you know, just, like, a tiny campaign, that'd be kind of fun. Because then I wouldn't have to really come up with anything and just all be right there. Good DM or evil DM? <laughs> Punishing every action you can? No, I think I'd be a good DM. I think I'd want to give everyone as much freedom as possible. I would just hope that I could do it properly. <laughs> you know, I could like... Allow you to do that in a way that actually made sense and was fun. But it could- it would be extremely chaotic and that's what I'm afraid of. <laughs> I'm afraid of it being too chaotic. Just making no sense. Oh, okay, um, last item, last item, last item, what do we back. want? Be careful. Okay. Let's go, please. Protect this jungle book. 
gets easier by realizing you can't plan for everything. I guess you just, at a certain point, you gotta wing it. But I'm so, like, OCD about shit, it would bother me to just, like, let people loose and just have absolutely no control over what the hell happens. Because people are wildin'. Be careful in the jungle. I take that back. I played three campaigns. And the second one I ever played, like, ever, ever, it was, like, the exact opposite of the ones I play now, where it was just complete chaos. It made zero sense. Everyone could just do and be whatever they wanted. And I didn't like it. I, I was just like, there's no rules, there's no structure, it's just madness. And it was fun, but like, it wasn't at all serious. There was like, there was like no consequences, no, but like, I don't know, because there's no consequences, that's, that's what made it not fun, you know? Because you could be and do anything and there's a structure to move the story along or whatever. There's no actual story at all. You died to totem? Wait, no. No. Is that possible? Oh, um, oh. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> I was like, totem doesn't fight you. Hey, Nanner. Uh, unless the totem is finally giving its revenge. Mercury no health. I'm- dude, I know. Like, I keep seeing all these low bros, bro. I'm trying! I wish I could make a world like Matt Mercer. I wish I was Matt Mercer. Are you kidding me? Shut up, friends! Fuck you guys! <laughs> you never control your players? Which would be fine, as long as I could guarantee that it was still, like, semi-organized and fun. Because I just don't want people to just, like, run around like crazy. And then we're just- we're doing nothing for, like, three sessions straight. Because everyone's just running around doing crazy, bonkers stuff that makes no sense. <laughs> it- nothing- nothing connects. There's no common- there's no string. It's just insanity. I personally am a huge fan of like very structured campaigns where it's like you have a common goal, you have a common objective, you know what the objective is, you know where to go, what to do. It's just how you go about it is like kind of up to you. But you still have a, a general idea of what to do. Nice. Man, we... Okay, you, actually, you know what? I'm not gonna say anything. I'm not gonna say anything until this match is over, because I'm not jinxing it. Okay. <laughs> Wait, HD, if you if you were brought up in D&D, &D, why don't you be a DM? Because I don't know... I don't know a lot of, like, the rules and the monsters and all that. Like, I, I barely even know how to roll. <laughs> I, like, I don't know a lot of the technical stuff. <laughs> Rev's learning to be a dummy mommy. <laughs> For science! It would be fun. I don't know when the heck I would do it, but it would be fun. Like, now I'd, I would just have to figure out what the hell, when I'm doing it, how I'm doing it. It's a lot that goes into D&D campaigns. I also wish I, I could have done like a, an in-person campaign at some point in my life. I've only ever done them online. I think it'd be really fun to do like an in-person one though. The enemy team has destroyed the gold Hello? HD, DM, HD, DM, no. Fuck, I was- oh, I have an Aegis. They're just so fast. God. I'm just a baby! Get bait has killed two sources of critical information. It keeps knocking out the third and it's pretty bait. <laughs> nice. <laughs> At that point, like, are they just screwed or can they still, like, do stuff? Are they still okay? 
Can they still progress? It's like, you know how video games have systems in place to where you can't get rid of things that will help you progress? I'm afraid that they're like that's going to happen and then they're just not gonna actually be able to progress. <laughs> At least the way it's set up. No one ever wants a GM, all wants a play. I, I am the complete opposite. I just don't know how. I just don't know how D like D and D works enough to like competently do that, <laughs> but I'd love to. It's like, oh, it, you got to use a wisdom saving rule for that. Why? For why? <laughs> Tell me why. HDTM, HDPM. I feel bad for my current campaign because, like, I've had to dip out on them twice because of the fundraisers on Sunday for Snooty. Like, we've done it two two Sundays in a row, which is usually our game days. So I missed out on on it twice. And um, it's like shit, man. I just I don't know. I feel like that, that weekends are pretty much like the only times that I'm ever available. And even then, it's kind of like mm, kinda. It's also the only times that I have away from like everything like stream work whatever stuff so it's like man trying to get another campaign set up i'd have to probably finish my current one because there's no way i could do both just so easy so easy Whoop. hey math I do like that playing online, it pretty much does all the mathing for you. And the rolling, and all the important jibber jabber. Um. Don't take it too hard. Look at yeah, I tried hitting Aegis there. It did not work. <laughs> cool. Cool, 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 cool. Was it because the Aries kept me from Aegising, or was it just my buttons weren't buttoning? Uh, Terraria boss? I see how it is. Boss more important than Rebel. Gotcha. Cool. I see where I stand. So it's kind of the reason why I liked being an assassin, because at least when I was an assassin in my D and D group, like I could just like run away and like st stealth around, be sneaky, and like never have to actually do anything, because <laughs> I didn't know how to do anything. Sundays are just such a good day for it, because like most people don't work. I don't stream that day. It's generally pretty chill. People don't make like big plans because next day is like work day. It's a good day for it. We like to talk about our Lord of the Save the Cthulhu. <laughs> nah, fake news. Cthulhu was a lie. <laughs> the Cthulhu was a lie. What edition? It's. I'm pretty sure it's current. Like, what are we on? Five? I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure all of the ones I've run run five. Except for, I don't know about that one that I ran with like a bunch of friends. Like it was like, the, the one that was like super, super duper random. I have no idea what that was. But that, it didn't matter because we only did it like maybe two or three games. So, and it was complete and utter madness. So it did not matter. <laughs> Hell, we, we didn't even feel like we were playing D&D &D at that point. It was just... Insane. I'm a recent player. Like I, the first time I ever played D and D was only like a year and a half ago or something. The only thing I've played is pretty recent. Ban Rebel. Uh, it's about time. I accept my punishment.
God, please take me into the sweet, sweet ban embrace. My body is ready. Wasn't high res gonna add more Lovecraftian horrors? I don't know. I I mean, I had assumed that since it was a pantheon that they would add more, but then someone said that they said they weren't gonna. But I don't know if that's for sure, because I don't remember hearing anything about definitely not adding more. So, dude, I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. If only I could stay alive. <laughs> Imagine staying alive for longer than like two minutes. <laughs> I don't personally know any of the other old gods, but I know a lot of people who do and who are like super passionate about it. Who's killed you? Who's didn't kill Vi? Whenever I DM, I'm torn between wanting to do diverse voices and being too self-conscious to do voices. Aww. Riz, you should totally do voices. That's so fun. I think it adds experience. I don't think it, everyone should do like role-playing stuff. I was super nervous about role-playing stuff when I started. I don't mind doing voices, but like just trying to come up with like what my character would do in certain situations is kind of awkward taco for sure. Ow. My DM always tries to have like these RP segments and I'm just sitting there like, dude, I don't know. <laughs> Come up with this whole backstory thing. It's fun, but it feels like a lot of work sometimes. House, fuck off. Whose house are you? Bro, your owner is dead, go away. Go away, house. Be gone. I can start geeking out about Cthulhu Mythos right now. See? See? There they are. Yo, you talk about Lovecraftian horrors and everyone, like, comes out of the right, fucking woodwork. Everyone, like, lifts themselves from their lurking states. I was like, did someone say Lovecraft? They don't see me, they don't know I'm here. All right, what I was gonna say earlier is I'm so fucking proud of us and I cannot believe we turned this shit around. <laughs> because goddamn, that was feeling pretty damn bleak at the beginning there. Hell yeah. I was born in the sus. Molded by it. Hell yeah. GG's. I completely sucked, bro. Same? My lane was just horrific. They will write epics about our game today. Good lord. And I, I feel like I do pretty good as Cupid normally, but yucky. <laughs> uh oh. Grays are mad at you. Grays are mad at you. <laughs> hey man, Tranquilize did good too. <laughs> Just, that's it. That's the tweet. Just Loki players. <laughs> Loki, Loki is so fun. Loki, Loki. One ability and done. Thank you for the follow. Um, Ash, do I have Ash still here? Please? Ash? Please? Oh, I did the wrong thing again. Zerk. Oh, I do have you added. Okay. Perfect.
Can you go double digit death? Uh, no, but it's pretty bad. I was so squishy. Horribly named cat. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised that we haven't, like, completely canceled everything about Lovecraft at this point, you know? This day in the age, shit. It's kind of it's kind of similar to the Tolkien or not Tolkien, Jesus. Uh Christ, what am I what is wrong with my brain today? Oh Lord. Uh Rowling. JK Rowling. I was oh my gosh. Oh I don't know why I think of Tolkien first. I don't know why. Uh, it's unexplainable. Demi, thank you for the follow. <clears throat> um, where it's like the the writer's kind of a horrible person. But the writing is like, you know, for some people, life-changing, you know, it's like important, influential, good, whatever. It's just really unfortunate. And do you separate the work from the horrible, terrible author? Love you, Gibbs. Get some seepies, boo-boo-boo. Thank you, thank you, Tranquilize. Thanks for playing with us. I got four SSR characters on my TF account. Dude, nice, Colt. Sick. I've only gotten one, and it's the fire cube, punchy, punchy. And it's kind of lame. <laughs> Rough start for me and support ended with 102 damage mitigated. Sick. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. Yeah, it was it was pretty rough. Beneath Ares combo, classic, classic, cancer-causing, uh, chemical. I don't know. Classic chemical-causing chemical. -causing chemical. <laughs> so much BS from that game, I almost broke my only controller. <laughs> Squeezing it too hard. Sheesh! Nah. I mean, if we had lost, it wouldn't have been that serious, you know? It would have been like, eh, whatever. I'm glad we pulled it back, though. That was insane. Like, we did really, really well. I'm proud of us. Thanks for playing, Dead Man. People hate Tolkien, even though he's a good Christian boy. Yeah, no, I, I don't know why Tolkien popped up in my brain. That was not at all what I was trying to think of. <laughs> uh, I'm just brain dead. Um, and it's Monday. It's only Monday. I don't like Kronos. Do you want to swap? Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I wanted to break it up a little bit. Oh, Jesus. Uh, sure. I don't know if you wanted Hercules. Oopsies. <laughs> I have a lot of good for good skins for Odin either. Yuck. You get to pick one. What? You can just pick an SSR? Huh? What? Well, I need to figure out how to do that. Shit. Love it or hate it, HBO's influence is reflected everywhere in horror. Too much influence, so I tend to just separate. Same with J.K. Picasso. Yeah. Yeah. I'm kind of in the same boat, but I also understand, you know, people being like, oh, I'm gonna boycott, you know, the HP movies, HP games, and stuff like that coming out. It's like, I get both sides. I just... It sucks when... You know, for, for some people, Lovecraft is like me to Harry Potter. You know, I grew up with it. I love it. I think it's amazing. I think it's like, just, you know, it's just really good story. Really good, like, wizard story for, like, this day and age, you know? But, God, she just, she had to ruin it, you know? It sucks. It really sucks. And you feel guilty for liking it still, even though you literally don't have anything to do with it, but just by supporting it and i think really the, the biggest thing t with it too is that she's still alive so she if so by supporting that you're supporting her and that's kind of like 
a catch-22 in and of itself. So, it sucks. It just really sucks. I wish it weren't like that, but you kind of just have to make your own ethical choices the best you can and hope for the best. Hope that you're, you know, doing the right thing. Um, I right, got some heals. Um, okay. My brain is brain farting so bad. <laughs> I'm like, what do I even want to build here? Uh, fuck. A lot of magic. Um, I'll get a Harvard for sure. Sorry, I'm taking so long. Thanks for playing, Bubba. Tried to get level 30 before I joined. Joined what? I'm sorry, Berserk. I'm sorry. I kind of thought you were going for Kronos. I like just swapped. And I was like, Ooh. I know Life Hercules. Okay, good. I'm glad you know how to play him because I think out of the two, I'm definitely better at, um, okay. Okay, well, I'll just take that away from me. It's fine. I think I'm definitely better with Odin. It's probably a better choice for me. You're gonna blow the world, dead man? Hot. Level seven for the newcomer event. Um, I'm level thirteen. Is gonna die here. Definitely gonna die here. <laughs> Worth. Um. Uh... Yep. Do it to it. At a certain point, it comes down to personal conscience. Yeah, yeah. It is just fiction. I think. I think it's like it's less about the actual thing and more about the actual giving of money. Like if you still have your Harry Potter books from way back when and you still read them, or like the movies, you watch the movies before all these shenanigans. You know, like I think it's fine to keep watching them and having them because you're not really giving her any more support by keeping the things you already have. I think it's. It, the biggest issue lies in the things that are new, like the Harry Potter game coming out. Um, a lot of people saying that they don't want to support that because it's still going into her pocket, even if she, even if she had nothing to do with the development, which the dev set says she does, like absolutely does not. But it doesn't really matter. She's still gonna get some sort of kickback from it, and that's really that's really the worst part. I wish it weren't the case. I wish someone could just buy the rights from her and we never have to worry about <laughs> her or her getting any kind of money ever again. But, you know, it's not gonna happen, so. Hey, Dartsy! My PC randomly crashed. Ah! That's why it crashed, Robbie, because you don't make ethical choices. Wish I felt more energetic. I joined Q and play the Saintly Ganesha. <laughs> That's okay, man. You'll have plenty of chances this week. It's like unofficial Smite week. <laughs> I'm gonna be streaming on Smite game and playing Smite on here, like most days this week. Trying to take a couple days this week to um, play some other things too, just so I don't get absolutely sick of shit. Set this to instant cast. Nothing I can't with my 
I have the most handsome pity boy on the planet. Aww. I love me some pity boys. Separate level? I guess I'll have you, I'll, I'll have you guys show me some shit tomorrow. <laughs> I feel like tomorrow is going to be a huge learning experience for me. I've just kind of been running around. I did some of the earlier quests and then I've like run around and, and like gotten some of the boxes that are just like everywhere scattered. So we'll see what happens. Oh God, I'm, I'm frozen here. That sucks. I, uh, but I, I, I'll be happy to have you guys walk me through some shit because I definitely don't know what the fuck I'm doing. <laughs> I've, I've got so many ideas for things that I want to stream, but the issue is like, lately I've been streaming on Smite Game a lot, either because SPL's taking a break, or because, you know, Snooty uh, obviously can't stream and uh, Loki Dad retired. So I've had to take on a lot more slots, and the slots that I get are always like directly uh, either on top of the streams that I have or like right before. And, I don't know, I just, I feel weird, like, I feel weird not playing Smite on the nights where I'm literally, like, streaming on Smite game. I'm gonna end up doing that anyway, just because I definitely don't want to be streaming Smite for, like, <laughs> I don't know, five days straight or whatever, four days straight this week, but, um... But yeah, I don't know. I'm just I'm trying to keep it as smite central as possible. But eventually once SPL starts up again and Sundi actually has her computer, so hopefully she gets back to streaming soon. No pressure on her, of course, but you know. She makes money just as much as I do, so it's I'm sure it'd be nice for her to get back to it. I think then we'll start being able to open up for more things. I've also felt really bad because I I owe patrons um, some patron only nights as well. And I haven't been able to do that for like about a month. I don't think I'm going to be able to get around to it this month. It's usually just like a, a Friday night like hangout sort of situation. But I've just been so like busy and like burnt out and like tired that I have felt like I haven't been able to do it. So, long story short, we've been doing a lot of shit. <laughs> Which I'm fine with, because I, I love Smite game. I love the community, I love everything. I'm not suffering or anything like that. I'm just trying to keep some, um, you know. Trying to keep some boundaries, so at the very least, I'm not like, freaking burnt out and like, losing my mind by the end of the week. So until some things change, we'll be able to do a lot. We'll be able to be a lot more free, and uh, free to free to do all kinds of different stuff. Try new games. Yada yada. For now, it's getting it's a little crazy. It's a little crazy busy, but um, eventually things will get a little bit lighter. Yay! Dog go pick. Dog go pick. What up, Aurelius? No, Smite, Smite doesn't hurt me. I just don't want to play it too, too much. Because I like the game and I want to keep liking the game. <laughs> Especially if I am contractually obligated to play the game. I don't want to be hating my life, so... Trying to keep it at arm's length as much as possible. While also still playing with folks who I meet through Smite game. Not going diehard smite every game all the time. It's the most healthy way to do it, I think. Fully because of you, your great shit talk, I would watch you play anything. <laughs> <Aww>. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate it. And that's, you know, a lot, I think a lot of people feel that way, and I definitely appreciate everyone who sticks with me through any game, but I also know the reality is a lot of people come here for Smite, and that's understandable. 
And I want to be able to keep playing Smite, so... It's all good. I just have to be careful how much I stream every week. Play every week. I definitely do not play Smite on my off time. So, that's that's one thing that I've been able to do. Is just keep it only as a stream game. A stream game only. That's perfectly fine with me. But I want to be able to, like, finish stuff, too. Like, we started Resident Evil, the first one, and I want to be able to, like, actually finish that. So I am going to take one of these nights to do that. At least. Oh, no. I've been put in horny jail. After we play that, I don't know. I'll probably go back to, like, Valorant and then maybe start playing some more Tower Fantasy because I have been enjoying it. The little tiny bit that I've played off-stream, I have enjoyed. I'm just gonna quit. No. I'm nowhere near close to quitting. I'm okay. I Trust me, I'm okay. If I need to take any breaks, I'll let you guys know. I'll probably, you know, cancel a stream here and there. This might hurts me so good. <laughs> Canceling one of my streams might happen, but I definitely won't cancel like a Smite game stream. I'll try my best to make those, but if I do feel like it, things are getting to be too much, I may, I may cancel a regular stream. Just to get my head in order. It's also the reason why I've been ending a lot of my personal streams an hour earlier than I usually do. Because we've been starting at 5 instead of 7. So, going our usual time is kind of, like, not gonna happen. <laughs> it's just too long. But I appreciate everyone being super duper supportive and awesome and coming by to all the streams. It means a lot. Resident Evil HD Ultra Turbo Arcade Edition plus Alpha <laughs> plus Ultra. I really- I, I bought all those other Resident Evil games. I kind of want to play those at some point. Aw, oh, dude. Is Knockout City still a thing? You know, speaking of kind of, sort of related, um, I really had a good time playing Multiverses. I kind of feel like I would love to get back to that, too. I- I haven't gotten to play that in, like, weeks. So that'd be nice. They've got their whole new, like, season coming out. they got new characters coming out. So that would be kind of fun. A <laughs> Nuzlocke? That would be kind of fun, too. Played three games of Smite the past week that weren't with Revel. <laughs> yeah, that's probably smart. Uh, next Resident Evil stream will be on Saturday. I don't really care for the Smite game this week. It's just 5v5 um, Conquest. That's what we do every week. Every freaking day that I play Smite anyway. So I was like, ah, screw it. I'll, I'll skip Smite night and we'll just play Resident Evil. Sorry to anyone who did want to play Smite night, but... <laughs> I definitely wanted to get at least one day of that, and then I also wanted to get at least one day of Tower Fantasy because we've been talking about it so much, and I really, really want to stream it. Because there's like a there's like a level cap that keeps increasing with each day, so I'm like, I don't want to play it too much off stream because I'm not gonna have enough on stream to actually play. So I'm trying really hard not to play too much. Uh, I want to build here. What do I want to build here? All dogs are 11 out of 10. Rate my dog. Yeah, but how do you ask us to rate your dog? A thousand million out of 10. I haven't even seen your dog, and I already know. Be a G. I love doggos! I wish I had a doggo. I don't want to be here no more. Season one's out. Yeah, see, I'd, I'd love to get into that. I'm not a, I'm not a fa fighting game player, but I had so much fun playing that. 
It's like it's like a fighting game that I feel like I could get good at if I actually played it, so I'd be down to play more of it. This Tower of Fantasy, is it really that different from Genshin? It's different in a couple of key ways, but like the general idea is the same. Where you it's a gotcha. Um the only difference being that you play as your personal character and not necessarily like one of their characters. I think you can you can turn into their characters, but I'm not really sure what that does exactly yet. I think they give you specific stats, but I'm not sure if you actually have to play as them or if you can just turn like toggle on the stat. But anyway, that's that's one thing I gotta figure out. But um But yeah, so so you have that. Um you can swap up to three and it's not like a party system like Genshin is it's just like it's like swapping weapons with like other RPG games um, the gotcha I've heard is better about getting new rarities so that's a little bit of a difference the graphics and stuff look pretty similar I think a lot of people would argue that the story is better in Genshin and the story in Tower Fantasy is like, okay. I've been enjoying it, but I'm like, two quests in. <laughs> um, trying to think where are the other ones that I saw. There are definitely more differences than that too. I just, I'm not even that far in. And I did not play enough Genshin to really tell. Alright, fine. If I'm trapped in here, you're trapped in here with me. Adorable doggo! I love pitties. They're so cute. I love how pitties look like they're always like smiling. Oh, Cold of the Lamb is another one. Someone else, I think it was Justin, mentioned that. And I was like, shit, I want to play that too. But then I got like four slots on Smite game this week. And I was like, fuck. <laughs> when the hell am I going to play that? Too many good games. And then like Overwatch is coming out in like October or something. There's too many games, chat. Not enough time for the games. That's okay, Kabrak. I'm sure I'll I'll play it again. I I like it enough for now at least. I feel like I could get through like the story maybe. And I like that Oh, that was the other thing. That was the other thing I forgot about Genshin. Um so with Genshin, the co-op is not really co-op. It's like you can get people in, but you're pretty much going to play your single player story with them versus Tower Fantasy is it like actually doing events and quests and stuff together and like getting experience and stuff together. It's like it's more of an MMO experience than Genshin is. Genshin is more of like a single player experience that you can co-op, if that makes sense. Um, so that's supposed to be the other difference. That's why I think it'll be a nice, fun stream game. I mean, I, granted, I'm probably going to be playing with a bunch of people who are, like, way higher level than me. So, um, I'm not sure how, like, the level scaling works, if there is level scaling. But, um... You might need replacement. see what I want to do. Let me think for a second. On my way. Defend the Titan. This will keep me in fight. Seeing my brain. Okay. Um. But yeah, so that was another reason. Um. Because I was like, you know, Genshin seems fine. But the, it, it didn't really feel like a, it was like a multiplayer game. It, it felt like a single player game first. With like some co-opable elements, but not really. So I'm hoping that Tower is more, way more fun. Playing with like viewers and stuff. What server do you play on? Um, New Era on the NA server. I'm pretty financially irresponsible. So if, I, if you want a game, I don't mind buying it for you. No, 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 no. I thought you were gonna say. I thought you were gonna say you were, you were gonna like buy all the stuff in Tower. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's totally not the money. Like, I'm, I'm financially stable enough. I mean, I, I've been spending a lot of money on 
new art and model stuff lately, but no, it's it's not it's not the money though. Um, it's mostly the time. If I could buy more time with money, then I would ask for more time. <laughs> I wish there was like one extra day in the week or something like. And I also wish I was able to stream for longer, but. Usually around like six to seven hours is when I start getting incredibly out of it. <laughs> it's a lot. Especially coming from Smite Game where you have thousands of people watching you. It can be incredibly stressful, but, um, you know, not too bad. It's doable. It's just like mentally pretty draining. So, no, don't worry about me money wise. I'm totally fine. Um,. <laughs> But that was that was just another game, the the Cult of the Lamb thing, where I was like, oh, that would be such a fun like multiplayer chat, like or not multiplayer, a, a chat game, I should say, because it's not it's not actually multiplayer from what I understand. It's just chat can be characters in my game, which is kind of cute. It's like Starview, Star Stardew esque. I was like, oh, that would be so cute. But then it's like, Jesus Christ, when am I gonna play this? <laughs> If I weren't a streamer for Smite game and I just was like playing whatever I want all the time, whatever, like, yeah, we could like play it any day, whatever, it wouldn't be a big deal, but. I, I want to be able to like facilitate, you know, meeting new people and growth and stuff like that through Smite. Meeting new people on Smite game, being able to play with them on my channel is great. So, that's all. I'm not like beholden to Smite or anything, but I, I, I use it, I guess. And I want to keep playing it, keep streaming it. Level scaling is in Genshin is you are your level and enemies are theirs. Their levels are determined by the world level of the host. Uh, what about Tower Fantasy? Do you know about Tower Fantasy? Thank you for the follow, by the way. I don't know if I said thank you. Um, I'm not sure if um. World level of the host. Okay, so, so in Genshin, then okay, okay, Bora, I see you. <laughs> so in Genshin, then like if if I'm level thirteen and people join me, everything is level thirteen for them. Because I guess that could be an issue if like someone comes in with like a really high level and they're just smirking everything. That could be kind of a bummer. Hey, Junkrat. Aw, dog in bed, he's seep. <laughs> ah! So cute. Seepy doggo. <laughs> Rep can marry us a cult of the live can customize our cult characters. It sounds so cute. You know, maybe maybe after Resident Evil, maybe once we beat that, we'll we'll make that our next like single player sort of do 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 do. I just really want to get Resident Evil done. I I got myself in a hole because now I'm like, okay, I really want to finish Resident Evil, and this is what happens with single player games. Is I only ever stream like five to six hours, so if I don't play it on stream, which I don't want to. It's like, yeah, it's just, it's piecemeal. <laughs> you can only play it piecemeal, so. I don't know how much longer we have left in Resident Evil, actually. Kind of curious. So sorry. I feel like I could have done more, but I don't know. Ha! They missed me with the wall. Suck it. Ah, suck it. Mariachi! Thank you so much for the raid. Hello. Ah, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what to do. We're screwed. I'm so screwed. I didn't even hit two like I thought I did. Fuck! I'm screwed! Oh, 
have ults, I can't even like trap them. Ah well, GG's. Way to go! Um Welcome, welcome, raiders. Uh, everything is whatever the world level the host is. There's a little more nuanced to that, but the host determines the levels. Definitely finish already, though. Yes! I'm playing uh, the first one, the HD remaster on uh, Steam. I've played the second and third remakes, and then I went back and played Resident Evil, the first one, in the best form that I possibly could find it in. <laughs> That's what everyone voted for. So I'm, I'm, cur I'm currently getting through that. I have no idea how far I need. I still need to go. <laughs> you ever play Hollow Knight? Yes, I love Hollow Knight. Bye, Admiral. Thanks so much for hanging out, Boo. Welcome, everybody. Hope you guys had a wonderful stream. Um, all right, we're gonna play one more. Close queue, and I'm gonna try to get anyone who I have not yet played with in queue. Sorry, you're still feeling sick, man. But hey, thank you so much for for playing. For hanging out. We did try. We got close. We got at least to the Phoenix. So that wasn't too bad. Um Do I still have Scion? Alright, I need Hello there, Leo. How you doing? I need Dee Dee and Scion. I need your guys' in-game names. Uh, Droxus? Did we play today, Droxus? Did we just play? <laughs> yeah, we did. <laughs> oh, that just goes to show how much I'm paying attention. Um, I also need Dartsy's in-game name. Do I have you added? I do not. Oh my god, I put the wrong name. Tokui! I said. Uh There you go. Um is Junkrat on? I'd like to join us. Ah, thank you so much Winters. Good luck on the homework. Glad to be of service. Remakes are great, but the original is tough for newer players. You could easily finish early games about three hours. Haha, <laughs> not me. <laughs> I am way too dumb. <laughs> I got- I literally got stuck on the fact that you have to inspect a key in order to figure out what the key is to even unlock the doors that I needed to unlock. It's insane. <laughs> I'm sorry, Droxus, I'm sorry. <laughs> I swear, I knew- I knew in the back of my mind I just... Bleh, I don't know. Losing it. Chillin'. Noise. Um... Do we have Scion or DD? DD, J, no limit. No problem, Junkrat. I will wait. Linda, do you wanna play? Uno mas? Wanna play? Uno mas? Buff Puff managed to get a turd follower. The Twitch user was funny, so let him do anything. It's considered the mascot of the cult. <laughs> a turd follower? <laughs> I do not know what that means, though. It sounds hilarious. He's a poo poo? He's a poo poo. Uh, did you see my. No, stop, Travis, stop. I just have really bad memory, which is why it's so hard for me to get through Resident Evil. Thank you, Ninja, for the emo gift. Ooh. Yo, Chiron's got a dance? That's what's up, dude. Hell yeah. Thank you, thank you. One of my diamonds. Whisper in game. Ooh. There you are. Yay. Okay. Thank you. DGJ or Scion, last call. Did I get you? I can't seem to find you. Did you get my friend request? Because now I'm just not even finding you at all. There you go. There you go. There you go. Doki doki. Okay, okay. There we go. Okay. Um, we got Dirt C, we got Junkrat. 
DDJ, Scion, anybody, anybody, Bueller, Bueller, Bueller. Um, okay. Is there anyone else I'm missing that has not yet played today? Did we play with Arsum? Is Arsum still here? Did we play with Arsum at any point? I think so. Oh no, wait, there, uh, there we go. Oh, come on. I do. I'm doing great. Haha. -ha. How are you doing? Nah, it's okay. That's okay. Um. All right. Well, Arsum's next in the list, and I don't see anyone else who has not yet played. So we'll just go by the list. Um. What? Should we do? I'll just do an arena. We'll see if we can get this um last win of the day. And then call it a day. He was a poop head. <laughs> so do you do like the Twitch viewers pick what they go in as? Is that how he got a poopy head? Or was it random? Yeah, we started on a Smite game, finishing off on our channel, just kinda hanging out, you know? Um, bowing down to our mommy goddess Ishtar. I'm actually like I. I like the idea of um the cult, the cult game. The perspective's a little freaky. You know what kind of reminds me of is the um don't I think it was called Don't Starve. I had to look because I was like, is this the same developer? But it was not the same developer. It's like kind of like that sort of um, 3D plane with like 2D looking people. Like they're pieces of paper, almost like Paper Mario or something. I was like, oh, that's really interesting. I really like the look of it. Audio Strox is sorry again for forgetting that I played with you. I hope you have a good rest of your night. Thanks again. I'm filling, so whatever you guys want to do. Hot! Poseidon hot! So hot! Alright. Um, get a hunter in here. Guardian. Let's see. Hey. Oh, who asked for the Isa game? I could play Isa. <laughs> what hand will you? Whoever asked for the Isa game a long, 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 long time ago. <laughs> I'm getting around to it now. The kittens say hi and are already pawing your model. <gasps> kittens! 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 Hello kittens! Hello kittens! Oh, oh, I'm over here! Oh, I'm over here now! Oh, what are you gonna do? Ah! So cute! Oh, Sion, there you are! Oh man! I was just- I was just about to get you in the party, bro! I was calling your name. Hello all, how are you doing? Piggy, fox, doggo, wolf, monkey. All the options in the extension. Come enjoy, oh lord. Oh lord. Yeah, that's fair. Adios amigo. Um, okay. Oh, they got a faff, okay. Um, okay. I am sus, bro. Hella sus. Thanks, Cabrack. Thanks for the support. <laughs> there could be stalkers anywhere. I'm gonna demand that everyone be a doggo in my cult.
Also, I'm, I'm guessing it'd be kind of weird if you, like, had to have the game to be a person, right? In the game. Like, you don't have to own the game. You can just be a viewer. Just a Twitch-enabled thing. My friends are done for the night. Bro, I'm, I am, like... I'm with them, dude. <laughs> We've had a pretty decent evening, though. Honestly, um, a lot of wins. We've been doing pretty good. I'm proud of us. This is like a bracket in your game, so I'm free to root for you. <laughs> the stipulations have been met for adoration. I appreciate it. I'll take what I can get. What's the set doing? I don't know how you're playing set in this godforsaken set in this godforsaken mode. Ugh. Blech. Oh, it's going pretty spiffy. Pretty spiffy. Had some good games. We've been big chilling. I'm Smite Game in here. Just been a busy, busy bee. I, um. Oh, I forgot to mention too. Um. Okay, but I'm gonna try not to die first. Um, I, I've, I've been going on like a commission spree, right? Cause I'm trying to get a bunch of new art for my model, so I, you know, when, when I finally get to debut with it, I can be like, look at all my pretty new art. And, um, I got this one commission. And, oh my god. You guys are just gonna absolutely go kablooey. You guys are gonna go insane. It is so good. I don't have it yet, but like, I, I know what it's gonna be. And I think you guys are gonna be so happy. <laughs> it's like, kind of along the lines of like, lewd-ish. It's, it's gonna be very nice. I'm so excited. I think, I'm hoping to maybe get it done within like, a couple weeks? Play Gilgamesh for the first time tonight. Sparta kick spam. Let us Sparta kick spam. Sp all my all my homies like Sparta kick spam. Sparta kick spam. Sparta kick spam. spam. Loves ready. it. <laughs> Gilk is really fun. It's funny to me how he's been nerfed so many times and yet still smacks up. Every time someone doesn't get picked, people play the Yu-Gi-Oh meme. It's not fair. Should have been me. <laughs> nice. Okay. Cool. I don't want to make people, like, have to get this, like, $25 game just to, like, be in the game, you know? That's fun. That's really fun. I like that. I love games with Twitch integration. There needs to be more of them. Air Raptor! Thank you for the follow. Lewd! Yeah. Oh, yeah. I knew that I knew that was going to get somebody excited. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Cam. Thank you for hanging out. Hope you have a good rest of your evening as well. I appreciate it so much. I like Gilgamesh also. Why have I never heard this before? Gilgamesh. Payday 2 Clocker skin? Payday skins in general. I'm sorry, y'all. This is gonna be the last game for me. And I'm gonna chillax it, relax it real cool. I've got a, a very, very long week of streams, so I wanna keep myself, um... Chill. <laughs> I want to keep myself alert <laughs> and not dead. So I apologize in advance for the shorter streams this week. I I'm excited to see it, man. I'm like, ah! I've been seeing everybody else's, and I'm just like, dude, duh. I'm stoked, man. Clock, clocker, cloaker, hey man, I, pl I played, I played payday for like an hour tops. <laughs> you had me fooled. Smite, sweat. No, 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 not smite, not smite. We were talking about Col Cult of the Lamb, I think it's called. It's like a new game. It's kind of like Stardew, but the Stardew was like demonic, <laughs> and then viewers like become the little NPCs in the game, like walking around and stuff, and it's super cute. And I think it's 25 bucks on Steam.
Uh, I think I'm gonna watch... I think the new episode of Only Murders in the Building came out, so I'm probably gonna watch that. And then after that, I need to either catch up with the Orville or I need to catch up with um, Resident Evil. Oh good lord. Oh good gracious. I did finally catch up with Demon Slayer. I don't know why it took me so long. But we got there. And then I'm also waiting for, like, Overlord to get done. I think, is there anything else other than uh, Shield Hero? I don't know how much time I'll be spending tonight watching stuff, but I think I could at least bang out, like, two episodes or something. Right? That's what I'm saying! I keep seeing other people play it and I'm like, damn it, I really want to play that. It looks so cute. But I, I think I, I think like, to be... To be financially responsible, I think I need to finish Resident Evil first and then I will buy Cold of the And we will, we will play that at some point. It looks super kawaii and cute. I am dying. I am dying, I am dying. I haven't built crit on a character in like the longest time. I'm wondering if today is the day that we go back to the crit baby. Let's see. Actually, eh, I'll keep the audio, but I'll keep the audio. That's still nice. I need a short. And you finished on here season two? Same, Leo. I watched like the first one or two episodes. Didn't care for it. I'm kind of upset that it's like so, I don't know. It feels rushed, but I heard it gets better. So I probably need to just sit down and watch it. Just, just get through it like a band-aid. Cause I really liked the first season, but this second season is not looking too hot. <laughs> it was rated extremely low too, so it doesn't make me think it's gonna get much better, but we'll see. Recent Overload uh, episodes feel shorter compared to his previous seasons. That's weird. Like, in a good way, like you're having so much fun you can't even tell how much time has elapsed. <laughs> or is it like actually literally shorter? Cause that would suck. The better the episode, the shorter it seems. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, is it a good thing? Like, does it just feel good? Second season is better near the end. That's what I keep hearing. It's like, how long do I give it, you know? How long before it's been too long? Before we just gotta give up? They're already planning for a third season, so I'm like, shit, man. I wonder if the third season will be just as bad? I don't know. Sailor Moon? Shit, I never even watched a Sailor Moon. Evil? No. I saw an ad the other day for a TV show, like a live action TV show called Evil. I'm assuming that's not the same thing. Uh oh. I'm in danger. No, no, I watched Spy Family. I did watch Spy Family. Like, uh, I finished it like a couple weeks ago? Ish? Week ish ago? <laughs> I did watch that. I, I've been waiting for a lot of things to get like dubbed and like finished. Um, so I did watch that. I caught up with Demon Slayer, like a bunch of stuff. Um, Shield Hero was like the last thing I think on my list that I need to catch up with. Um, I loved Spy Family. Yes, 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 yes. Love, love, love. Um,. Is that is that what it was? Oh, for some reason I thought you were talking about anime. My bad. Okay, yeah, I've seen ads for it. I've not watched it. You're saying it's on Amazon Prime? You know, Amazon has never done me wrong with a series before. So I'd be willing to give it a shot. 
I've liked almost everything I've watched on there. I've also heard that Sandman on Netflix is really good. I'm kind of considering maybe watching that. It's supposed to be sort of kind of superhero-y, I guess. How dare you youngsters offend me like this. I, I have no idea where Sailor Moon, like, ran. Because when I was a kid, like, I watched, like, Yu-Gi-Oh! Or Pokemon. Smite? I, I think, le legit, I think you meant Smite. <laughs> Yo, thank you for the sub, man. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Um... What was I saying? Oh yeah, I, I don't- so I don't know where Sailor Moon was, because I watched like a bunch of random anime when I was a kid. I didn't watch Dragon Ball, but I knew it existed. But I- I didn't know about Sailor Moon. I had no idea where it was, or how to watch it. I didn't know it existed. Until like, later. Toonami? I don't- what even is that? Was that like- If it wasn't Cartoon Network, Nickelodeon, or Disney Channel, I had no idea where to watch it. <laughs> I was a simple rebel with simple needs and only needed. Only needed three channels. <laughs> Anything past those three channels, I don't know. <laughs> born in the 90s? I was born in the 90s. Maybe I was maybe I was too young for it. Maybe that's why I missed it, because I just like wasn't really like a conscious, uh, uh, old enough uh, uh, kid. <laughs> I don't know. Weird. The crits are critting! Ninety-two. Salmon also good. Ugh. Ugh. Give it time. They're about to do the. They're about to ruin the Lord of the Rings prequels. We'll see. I'm holding out hope that it's fine. I I hate to go into things thinking they're gonna be bad. I always give them hope. And if it's bad, then fine. It's bad. But you know, I want to give it a shot at least. Give it that much. I I I'm prepared to feel. Amazed. <laughs> I'm prepared to get my socks knocked off. I'm 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 good. I'm excited for it. If it sucks, oh well, well. Wouldn't be the first time they ruin something I love. Not Amazon, but just the they, the royal they, I guess. Looking at you, Game of Thrones. I ain't gonna read shit. Cartoon Network? Man, the, where the heck was I? Unless it was like 90s Cartoon Network and then I wouldn't have seen it. Because I was a baby. <laughs> Maybe it was around the time the DBZ was playing and I just, I tuned, I tuned out for DBZ. I wasn't into it. Now is such a good time to be born when it comes to video games. Well, like, born or like lived through? Because when you're like born, you're not you're not old enough to have played or seen some of these things. So it's like kind of a waste. <laughs> it's a waste for me. I'm I'm just it was a waste. Like I didn't actually start playing or watching things until like like later, like like 2000s. You know what I mean? I was bit big. I think the only thing I actually played in the 90s was like, Pokemon? Maybe? Hey babe, come on over. I'll um, treat you real nice then. I'll treat you real nice. <laughs> I don't know, Chad. I think they're mad at me. They were in Cowboy Bebop with that live trash live action. I'm gonna tell you something, Chad. It stays between us, okay? I've never seen Cowboy Bebop, but I have seen the live action. 
and I didn't mind it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just really had to get that off my chest. Tsunami is peak anime for children in the West. <laughs> I think Toonami must have been like what like Yu-Gi-Oh and stuff was on. I don't know where where did I watch Yu-Gi-Oh and Pokemon? Is that also Toonami? Maybe I just selectively watched Toonami. I heard that the the people who are making Stranger Things are making another live action Death Note. And I was like, because we didn't learn enough from the first time. <laughs> Such a time. Such a time. I do miss the, the OG Yu-Gi-Oh days for sure. Whatever they come up with now is just garbage. GG's. Watch the anime and change your mind? I kind of wanna. Now that I've seen it, now, now that I've like watched it backward, I feel like I'm gonna have... I don't know. Still a more favorable take of the live action, just simply because I went in with no expectations. Oh. What was four kids? Fuck. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I was watching. I was just watching it. It was just on my screen. And I just sat there and I drooled. Blah, just taking it all in, you know? Sup, Justin? Fucking Halo 4, 5 is infinite. What do you mean? Halo Infinite is, is the Halo of our generation. It's the Halo of all generations. It's peak Halo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, y'all. That is it for me. Whew. Big numbies. Big numbies. Yo, crit's still kind of fun, actually. I should build more crit. Hope you guys had fun. I had a lot of fun. Live, all live actions to shit. <laughs> I feel like I, I, I'm surprised I didn't just get like immediately canceled. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they really hated me. <laughs> we did fantastic, everybody. Good job. GG's. So many good gamies. Thank you guys for, for playing games, for hanging out, for having a good old bash. Um, I will be back on Smite Game tomorrow, same time as I was today. 5 p.m. my time, mountain time. Uh, 7 p.m. EST. So if you guys want to hang out with me over there, you are welcome to. And then I will be right back here playing some more Smite. Um, at 8 p.m. my time. 10 p.m. EST. Also, I, I have this ad on Twitch. Secret Headquarters. It's got Owen Wilson looking like a fucking badass. So that's pretty cool. Anyway. <laughs> the heck? The heck's going on me? I have hiccups. Um, let's see. Ow, my freaking hands. Oh. Let's see, let's go find someone to raid real quick. Let's find someone. <gasps> Beautiful. Maybe we find a new person? Maybe we find a person playing Cult of the Lamb so I can see what's going on? Or Tower Fantasy, maybe? Mm. Let's go through this person. Uh, safe for work cold, nothing bad happening. That sounds- that sounds safe, chat. That sounds like a safe bet. Let's go- let's go and raid this person. Uh, how do I say this name? Yozora Owie. Yozora Owie. Go check them out. They're playing Cult of the Lamb. We're gonna go check it out and see if the game looks cool or not. Um... If you guys have not yet already, be sure to join the Discord. Sometimes I do giveaways there. Sometimes we watch stuff over there. It's a fun time nonetheless. And then on Twitter, be sure to follow me so you know what's going on. Get all the hip haps. See all the beautiful artwork that I've commissioned. <laughs> Please, God, I've spent so much money. Go check out the art that I've commissioned. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Bye bye! Mwah! I love your faces!